Episode 3, Long Road Ahead. Let's go. Oh, man. I am so sorry, Chad. Previously on The Walking Dead. I am. Previously. Get the gates open! You got like 45 got minutes wounded. max out of me. I want to know why you thought I mean, more that's better than nothing. Was a good idea. You've been good to me and my family. You saved Duck from those monsters. And you stood up to Larry at the drugstore. I won't forget that. No one's trying to cut you out of anything. Those look like the people who raided my Calm camp. Calm down, you're paranoid. Fuck you! I got body. Did you tell anyone out there who you were? Or that you were tied to this place? That's right. I know who you are. And I know you're a killer. He's not dead! Somebody help me! Come on! We know this guy's not gonna make it. No! <laughs> Sounds like a car. It's a shitload of food and supplies back here. We have to take this, Clementine. We need it to survive. Don't worry, little girl. Bandits got their eye on that dairy. As long as they keep getting food from them, you'll be safe. Turn my volume up a little bit. Oh, man. All right, so it seems like you guys really like this episode. I mean, we'll see why. Oh, man. How you guys doing, by the way? Sorry if I, sorry if I yelled at you about that. You took the food. We didn't have no choice. We had no choice. We had to take the food. We were struggling. We didn't know what to do. And on top of that, the people that had all the food with the car, they basically was asking for it because they left the door open. The door was unlocked. I had no choice, okay? Don't yell at me. It's not my fault. I know you would have did the same thing as well. Well, you probably didn't, but still. Okay, don't get mad at me, chat. Don't get mad at me. All right, episode three. All right, what we got up here? Looks like this is our lucky day. Yeah, this might actually go smoothly. We deserve it after last time. Yeah, I can see. I can see you agree with Clementine. I agree with her too. But then I really started to think more about it because we had no food. We had nothing. So we needed. We needed something. Oh, man. Lee, where do you come down on staying or going? You mean packing up the motel and getting in the RV? Yeah, we've been talking about it. But have you made up your mind yet? Mm, we should go. We should go. The motel's run its course, and it's not safe. You're damn right it has. We pile into the RV and don't pull over till we see water. And if Lily's dead set on staying, then, well, that's the way it goes. I don't know how long they've... I don't even... Okay, oh, the military was like here. Time, over the rig, into the pharmacy, and scrape together whatever supplies are left. We didn't leave much in there. Hey, we're out of options. Something's better than nothing. Like I said, something's better than nothing. Oh, Shit. snap. You okay? The ladder's come loose. I'm not sure how many more trips she's got in her. I'm not sure how many more trips we've got in us. No kidding. Chad, wouldn't it be funny if he actually fell, though? <laughs> you live no matter You live no matter the choice. Yeah, no one wants to steal, but sometimes you got to do bad things to survive. That's another thing. Like, you got to you gotta make, like, that's the thing. Even being the main character, you got to make some tough choices. So at least some people can understand. And on top of that, we had to kill Larry because he passed. Well, he didn't pass out. Um, He had a heart attack and he wasn't breathing. And either way, he was dead. And if he's dead, then he would turn in like the next 15 minutes. And that would make the whole situation crazier because think about it. Kenny could have turned, Lily could have turned, Clementine could have turned, and we could not let that happen. So, anyways, so I think, I'm assuming we gotta fix that. No, we cannot climb up that ladder. That ladder is too broken right now. Okay, so it looks, it looks like the military has been here. See this, right? Y'all see this? Oh, look at this. I got a helicopter, got this Jeep. What is that? Oh, wait, were we here? They're I think we were here. By all the fallen concrete. What's it called? Yeah, so it seems like Kenny is always right. Hmm. Alright. Well, the only option we got here is to push the Jeep. And this can help us get up here. Alright. Oh, can I... Oh, I can't push it. Is it stuck? Don't tell me there's a brick underneath this. What is this? Oh, it's a... Oh, a winch. Can I grab this? 
Yeah. Lily's not doing so good, huh? Mm. It's not good. I'm, I'm worried, honestly. It's not good. I'm worried. No, it's not. I hope she doesn't snap. I might have saved our lives in that meat locker, you know? Yeah, man. Rest in peace, Larry. Even though he was a very cranky old man, I'm sure he had a good heart inside. Okay. Now we can, wait. Now can we push it? I think it worked. All right. What else did I do here? So we got the we got the winch and everything hooked up. Now can I can I push it now? Is the tire stuck? It's completely flat. Oh, that's why. Okay, the tires are flat. Yeah, so I cannot push this thing. So I hooked it up, but what can I do here? Yeah, I can't. Well, use the. Oh, use the winch control. Oh! There we go. I didn't even see that. The girl still upset with you for agreeing to take that stuff from the station wagon? I hope not. I hope not. She'll get there. I can think that. Okay, now I can climb on. And let's Duck get was ladder. asking about that guy at Herschel's farm last night. Really? I wasn't sure it phased him. Of course it did. Still? Well, actually, it was a scary situation, actually. It was a scary situation for him. Sean dying and all. I'm just worried he'll always think it was his fault. Alright, come on. You're sure you're up for this? Lee, I'm fine. I've got this. Give me your hand. I don't want to hurt you, Kenny. Uh, oh, shit. oh! Is he in pain from getting shot that one time? There better not be no walkers. What happened? What the hell happened? Thought you said you could handle it. God, you ever been shot before? I'm sorry. I knew it. Christ. You think you... Ah! Who's screaming? Go, go, oh! Help me! Get up! Okay, we still got a survivor. Help me! She's making too much noise, though. Oh, God. Shut up, woman! What the hell is that? A walker? Walkers don't scream, do they? Jesus, I don't think so. Come on, I gotta help her. Oh snap! Um, it's a girl. We have to help her. How? There's no getting to her. We gotta do something. We gotta. Oh, never mind. Never mind. We can't help her. She's been bit. Fuck. Gotta shoot her. Put her out of this misery. You don't know we're here. What do you mean? I mean, we leave her alive, and she draws them all to her, buying us time. Can't think about it. We're always worrying about the ones we can't see. She stays alive and brings them all out of their holes. Oh man. See, we're already. We already have to make a tough decision. Either save her or just go up. What do I do? Oh my gosh. Oh. I can't. You know what? I, I can't do it. She's already dead as it is. If I do that, that's gonna that's gonna cost too much attention. Let's go. She'll keep busy. See, gunshots is what they're really attracted to. So if I did that, we would have been dead at that point. Jeez, bro. Oh, I forgot to mute the no, the notif no the achievement sound. I forgot to mute that. That's fine though. I'll do it next stream. We should be good to clear this place out, but we ain't got all day. Get everything you can out of these racks. Don't That's forget right. underneath the counter this time. I'll clear it down here, and then we gotta go. How is she still screaming? Okay, what we got? Ooh, a medicine box. Okay, give me that. Give me that. Supplies. More supplies. Energy bar. What's this? What's this? Medicine. Nice. What? What's that? What's that? What's that? Bro, we are stocked up right now. All right, is that everything? All right, that's everything. Anything in the shelves? Medicine. What else we got? Nine items. She's gone. Okay. There's not much time now. All right. Oh my gosh. Open it. Open it. Open it. Energy bars. Okay. Take that. Take that. Take that. Bro, just grab everything. Come on. Grab everything. Give me the loot. Give me oh yes bandages really useful. Give me the loot. Let's go. Wait oh take that take that take that. Oh can I get that? No I can't. I'm trying to get at least like 20 items. Wait no 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 wait 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 wait. Is that everything? Wait Chaz that oh snap. 
I think that's. Oh no, it's not. There we go. Oh, that was close. That girl didn't I did not nothing. see that. Up and over. All right, let's go. Go. Come on. Oh my gosh. Woo! Oh, I'm getting crushed. Bro, help! I'm getting crushed. Oh. Incoming. Come on, Lee. Um. I'm dead already. What? Then I. What happened there? I jumped over. Okay, jump. Let's go. Oh, what? Is this was? Oh, it wasn't working at first. What? I'm pressing Q. Why was it not working? Okay, now. I don't know what that was. Fridge. All right, fridge, fridge, fridge. Push it, push, push. There we go. Come on! Run! Oh my gosh. Oh no! What am I supposed to do? Mm. Get back. Get back! Get back! Oh, I just realized these are the military dudes. Okay, they got body. Oh, snap. Oh, I was pressing the wrong key, maybe. Maybe that's what was going on. Oh! Get impaled, boy. Alright. Uh, I think it's time to go now. Yep, time to go. Time Let's to go. go pal. Let's go. Yeah, I was probably pressing the wrong key. I think I was pressing the E key instead of the Q key. All right, that was my fault. That was my bad. Yeah, look at this motel. We cannot stay here. We've been ambushed. Oh, man. However, I think I dropped one piece of uh, equipment. Common mistake. I wouldn't say it's that common, really. Oh, Clementine's wearing the hoodie. You're back. Ben found some stickers in a drawer, and I put them on my walkie. Hey, sweet pea. That's neat. I'll find you in a minute. All right, it's good to know everybody's managing well. However, we lost like what two members, I think. Looks like we got the kid on watch again. What'd you get? We might as well leave a sign out that says the men are gone. Come and rape our women and children. Ha. Huh. So, what did you get? Uh, got a lot of stuff, actually. A lot of stuff. We're fine, by the way. Nice work. This'll keep us going. If we carry on like this, we'll get through the winter here. The winter? We'll freeze our asses off here. Winter? Piling into an RV with you two after what you did to my dad is so appealing. Why wouldn't it be? You know, I'll do what it takes to keep everyone safe. We're already safe. Take a look at the wall, Lily. That's not graffiti. Those are bullet holes. And we got enough arrow shafts sticking out of it to dry our laundry. We have to go eventually, Lily. We don't have to do anything. You didn't want to go because of your dad's health. But he's gone now. Easy, Kenny. Yeah, Kenny, you didn't have to say that. At it again, are we? Can it, Carly? Don't boss people around. I'm sorry. Somebody needs to make executive decisions for the group, though. And I don't think you're capable anymore. We're strongest together. It can't be you versus us, Lily. We're sorry for what happened to your dad, but we're in this together now. What about the food situation? What about protection? What about when this place falls? Somebody's got to be thinking about this shit. How has this not been working? We have everything we need. Because of me, Lily. That's BS, Kenny. And you... We got all the protection we need. And when 15 bandits hop over that wall in the middle of the night? They won't be going back over. Everything that happens to us is another excuse for you to pull this crap about leaving. All I want is a week of peace, of not hearing it. Do you know how we got these supplies? We got lucky and let a girl get eaten out there. What? Some girl came screaming out of an alley. She had dead hanging all over her. She gave us enough time to get everything we could out of the drugstore. And you just let her suffer like what? Like bait? God, what is happening? It was a mistake. We got our supplies, but we should have tried to save her or put her out of her misery. Well, you had Kenny with you, so some options were off the table. You should be thanking Lee for not shooting that girl. It's not so easy for him. Aiden, you're fine. Look, Macon and its people aren't savable. It's not a town. It's full of walkers. And the people who were left are dying and wandering out onto the streets. 
It's hell on earth, and it's coming this way. It's not going to be easier out on the road! How would you know? What I know? I know you're not above murder. I know somebody has been stealing our supplies. That's right, stealing! And I know the list of people I can trust here gets smaller every day! Now everybody get out! <sighs> she is not having it. I don't even know anymore. She'll get over it. She's riling everybody up otherwise. You understand, Ken. She's right about one thing. None of this is getting any easier. It just sucks that they're trying to influence Ken, or like, they're trying to implement Ken of him being oh, the bad guy. To a head. You could say that. Well, I think you did good today. And I find myself thinking that most days. Thanks. It's probably worth following up with Lily about what she was saying about missing supplies. With her wound up the way she is, I don't want to see her paranoid. No question. And I'd like to talk when you've got a minute. <sighs> Stealing supplies. Look, like I said, now in that last episode, the people were basically asking to get robbed at that point. Because like the door. Okay, so their car, first of all, the lights were on. Second of all, it was unlocked. And three, the doors were open. Like, come on now. Like, let's be real here, people. Like, at least, come on. Like, I, okay. It's, uh, it's ridiculous, man. But it's still crazy how The Walking Dead just, like, it, it, it makes everybody turn twisted. It's so ridiculous. Okay, so right now, I guess uh, we can go upstairs, but I'm going to uh, check around. Uh, let's talk to Ben. Hey, Ben. What's up, Lee? Have you seen anything weird on watch? Is there anybody out there up to anything? Nope. Really quiet. Really? Yeah, totally. Which is good. Did you ever come down here to making much? I didn't have much reason to. My parents would let me take the car into the city on the weekend. But what's in Macon? It's kind of a waste of time compared to Atlanta. I grew up in Macon. Oh. I didn't mean to say it's crappy or anything. No, oh, I get what you mean, man. It's super nice. I mean, not now, but I bet it was. Is... It's, it's fine, Ben. I, I, I get what you mean. What do you think about Lily? She scares the crap out of me. That's a reasonable thing to feel. I'm just worried she's going to snap. Talk to you later, Ben. Bye. I'm kind of worried about that, too. I have a feeling Lily is just going to go absolute berserk and then do God knows what. Because we don't know what she does. We don't know how she reacts when she has gone over the limit. We just don't know. Um, Talk to Kenny real fast. Hey, you two. How are you doing? We're okay. Just having a little spat. We all carry guns now, and I don't like it. It's the way it's got to be. I know, but I'm not getting used to it. I'm sorry. How are you, Lee? I'm gonna try hard with Lee. You guys, tr um, you guys trust everyone here? You guys, uh, trust everyone here? More or less. I obviously have my problems with Lily, but I don't distrust her. Yeah, we can't turn on each other any more than we have. You need to try harder with Lily. You guys gotta straighten this out. I don't know how straight we can get it, given all that's happened. So what then? Time will come, we'll have to do what's best for our families. And that's what we'll do. I mean, eventually, y'all gotta figure this out. About the guns. Don't you start. I just wanted to say, Cat, it's probably good they make you uncomfortable. Thank you, Lee. <sighs> but we need them. There's no doubt about that. I'll talk to you later. You gotta understand, Cat. Like, this is a whole different time now. We can't... Like, we cannot walk out... We can't even go outside without being unarmed. Like, we're basically a walking... We're wa we're a walking piece of meat if we don't do that. Alright, Clem, how you doing? Hey, Clementine. Hey, Lee. What's that you're working on, Clem? It's called a leaf rubbing. 
My teacher, Miss Moore, showed us how to do them when we went to the botanical garden once. See? It's the same. Um, kind of. Ah, that's really something. I'll make one for you, too. Oh, do you like it here? I don't like it here. Do you want to leave? Where are we going? Somewhere else. I don't know. Maybe if I knew where? Yeah, that'd be a good thing to know. I'll talk to you later, Clem. That's okay. a really good thing to know. Um, talk, Yeah, I was just about to talk to Carly after we got done talking with Clem. All right, let's go upstairs. I'm just really trying to figure out how we're going to straighten things out with Lily. Talk to Lily yet? No, not yet. I will. What I wanted to say was, I've been thinking a lot about you. Uh, about me? What about? I think about you too. Wait, oh, I pressed the wrong key. I, I meant to press Our two. Our group is small. I, You're small. Dang, I did not mean to say that. Yeah, Chad, don't look at me. I meant to press They're two. They're killer. Carly, Jesus. And I think people should know. Not because they deserve to, and not because you're a bad man. I think the opposite of those two things. People need to know because we're hanging by a thread here, and I can't see Lily talk about you without thinking it's the next thing she's going to say. You don't have to tell everyone, but think about who you trust and take the opportunity while you have it. You're probably right. Of course I'm probably right. People might be pissed. And telling them might cause some trouble, but it will be a far cry from what'll happen if they don't hear it from you. Yeah. So you'll do it then? I'll let people know. You're totally right. Good. I think it's for the best. Don't call me small. Oh! I'm not... Hey, listen. No. Is there anything else you want to talk about? Um, now listen, I'm not even going to say that there's anything going on between me and Carly. She just, she just kissed me. That was it. Don't, guys, don't get it twisted, okay? That was just a little, okay? And plus, I didn't even mean to say that I meant to press two. I, I, I didn't know what the option was, but I said I thought I was thinking about you too. Come on now, chat. Listen, I mean... I wouldn't say I have Riz, but I would technically say I got that accidental Riz, you know what I mean? Because I didn't even mean to say that. So, anyways. Alright, um, what else should we talk about? Do you think people are ready to hear about me, or do you feel safe here? Do you feel safe at least? Do you feel safe here? Show me a bath with a heated floor in a high-rise apartment and hand me a full-bodied Malbec and then I'll feel safe. I don't know, this place is fine, but we all know that that could change at any second. <laughs> Come on now, listen. I don't know. I, 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 I. <laughs> could be good. Some I don't know about all that. I mean, cause we're not even on that level. First of all, I would consider me and Carly as friends, but I don't know how she consider us as. You, I mean, you got you. You guys, let me know. What do you think? What do you think? Carly even considers Lee as you let me know I don't know because that little kiss that could have been nothing I mean don't friends do that I mean I'm sure friends do that or like whenever they meet each other they phrase French kiss each other they go like you know what I mean something like that so that could have been nothing but you guys let me know I don't know uh, you think people are ready to hear about me you really think people are ready to hear about me it's not a matter of ready or not there's never going to be a good time but there are going to be a lot of bad ones Right now doesn't seem like one of them. But everyone's different. Who knows how each person would take it, you know? Maybe it's worth thinking about who you want to tell. You, uh, have any thoughts about Lily? I worry about her. That's about it. She keeps trying to run things, but it's just not working. I'm gonna look into this thing. Good idea. Alright, I guess I gotta talk to Lily now. But before that, I got to, um, like I said, I got to let everybody know about me. So I'm going to talk to Katja. I haven't talked to her. Hi, guys. Um, let me talk to, um, talk to Katja. Can I talk to you about something? Sure. Is everything okay? 
See, I will talk to Kenny first, but I, I have to let Katja understand first. I was on my way to... Oh. I was uh, on my way to prison three months ago. You've always looked at me with kind eyes. I wonder if you could still do that if you uh, knew I was a convicted felon. My goodness, for what? How much trouble can a teacher get into? Well, plenty. But it had nothing to do with that. It was for murder. Why? He and my wife... Uh, That's were... enough. Tell me what happened when you were locked in the fridge at the dairy. Okay, I got you. I held Lily back and Kenny made sure Larry didn't get up. What did he do? Oh my god, I'm still... He smashed his head in. <gasps> I'm spilling so much tea right now. I think I should have talked to Kenny first. Gotcha. I'm spilling too Everything much tea. Everything keeps changing. Man. How, oh, man? I think I should have talked to Kenny first. Oh, man. Oh, what is Katja going to think of me now? Oh, man. Well, can I, okay, can I talk to Kenny, though? Let's talk to Kenny. Uh, Kenny, you got a second? Kenny, you got a second? I need to tell you something. Sure, pal. What you got? I just really don't know how Kenny's gonna take this in. I really don't know. It's serious. Oh, no. What'd the she-devil do to you? Shut up, man. See, he's a bro. He's one of, he's like the, oh, jeez. I tell was, him. uh. On my way to prison three months ago. No shit. No shit. It wasn't for touching kids, was it? Oh, mm -hmm. man, come on, man. What? Bro! I ask. No. I killed a guy in a fight. Why would you even assume mm -hmm. that? It must have been a real piece of shit if you had to haul off and kill him. So we're straight then. Lee, look at everything this mess has got us doing now. I'm sorry you went through whatever you went through. Yeah, we're straight. All right, well, at least uh, he kind of just brushed that off. But, like, out of all things, you really had to assume that? Like, come on, man. That is just, that was so out of pocket. I don't even know what to say anymore. Okay, um, now I'm sure, I'm sure Clementine already knows, but I think I should let her know if I haven't. Oh, yeah, I need to tell you something. Clem. I need to talk to you for a second. Okie dokie. <sighs> I have to let her know. The day you and I met, I was in a car accident. I remember. Your leg was bleeding. The car I was in was a police car. And I was on my way to jail for committing a crime. I need to tell you now. Because I don't want you to hear it any other way. Okay. Do you have anything to say? I don't think so. You can uh, go on back to your things. I'm sure. I'm sure she. Had, I'm sure she took that a lot more. Clementine understands what you did. Well, I mean, like I said, I have to let everybody know. All right, now let's uh, talk to Ben. Now, Ben, we only recently met him, so I don't think it should be too much of a problem to tell him. Hey, Ben, I need to tell you something. Surely, is it about my watch? I'm trying to do a good job. You're doing fine. I was, uh, on my way to prison before this. Whoa, seriously? What, um, were you in for? It's not important. Oh. Just, if you hear anything, it's probably true. And now you know. Thanks for trusting me, man. I, uh, I... Ben, relax. Okay. Ben won't forget that. See, now, the only people I know that have actually took in this pretty, uh, actually handled this pretty well is Clementine and Kenny. I don't know about Ben, though. See, because Ben seemed pretty scared. I don't know how he took that. So, let's talk to Lily now. All right, Lily, you in there? See, I don't even want to talk. I'm kind of scared to talk to Lily, Loki. Yeah, she's not holding up too well. 
I'm sorry. You don't have to apologize. Did you come in here to give me hell or to coddle me? Um, I'm following up about the stolen supplies. I wanted to follow up on what you said about stolen supplies. Do you know what's going on? I don't. I just heard you mention it. And you came in here to confess? I'm not stealing shit. I came in here to help. There's a traitor. Somebody, one of us, out there. He or she or they have been taking things. What do you mean? For real? Who? What do you got? Yes, for real. And I don't have shit. I just know. Lily. It counts off and it's the good stuff. Antibiotics, oxy, fuck, anything with opium in it. I see the count, and it's fine. I keep my own. That one's getting messed with. I'm a fucking mess right now, but I'm not stupid. I know what happens if I start a witch hunt. So you want me to start one? I want you to poke around. What's there to go on? I was not expecting this at all. I was trying to I tell her about- I found this tossed into the garbage. Huh. We don't toss out equipment, we fix it. You'd only try to get rid of a flashlight if you were using it when you shouldn't. Hmm. So, I mean, it's really just a few things. It's just a few things. It's not a big deal. Bullshit, it's not. An attitude like that puts you on the top of the suspect list. Wow. Well, that was fast. A mystery. Duck? Jesus, Duck. Duck, what are you I'm doing? I'm sorry. I heard you guys talking. You need to unhear all of that. Yeah, duck. Can why? Can I help? What did I just say? You're the greatest detective, and I can be Dick Grayson, your ward. Duck. That's Robin. I know who it is. Oh man. I don't know, bruh. I'ma just, you know what? Fine. Can help. Don't tell anybody. Secrecy. Yeah, good. What do I do? I, I don't know. Go look around. Let me know if you find anything weird. I'm on the case. See, now, I'm not trying to start anything. If you want to help, then by all means, go right ahead. And low-key, why is Duck being so nosy? Well, I mean, at least we're having some assistance. It's not much, especially from especially because it's from a kid. But... Something's better than nothing, so I guess it's fine. Um, I uh, talked to Kenny about who I am. And? He was cool. He just worries about his family. That wasn't so hard, was it, tough guy? I talked to Katja. How'd she take it? She was fine, I guess. I think she's more upset about Kenny. Because of the St. John's? What exactly did he do back there? Well, don't you start now. I talked to Clementine about things. How'd she handle it? I don't know. She's tough to read. She adores you. Don't worry. I, uh, told Ben. You told Ben? Funny you picked him. Low risk. I take it he didn't know what to do with the information. Not even a little. He's just happy I told him something. At least. Do you know anything about this flashlight? It's broken. I know it's broken. And the batteries might be in backwards. It uses just one. Everything oh. should. What was the question? Did you break the <laughs> flashlight? No. Okay. I'll talk to you later. I'll talk to you later. All right, so now, so it seems like we're on a bit of an investigation. So Lily suspects that somebody in the group is messing with the equipment and taking stuff. But we're gonna, um, we're gonna see if everybody, if anybody knows about this flashlight. Now, obviously, I'm not even gonna suspect Clem because she has nothing to do with it, you know. So, um, let me uh, talk to Katja. Do you guys know anything about this broken flashlight? Fuck, we don't got many of those. Yeah, it's a problem. The glass and the bulb are all busted out. I saw some broken glass over by the ice machine. I meant to clean it up before the kids hurt themselves on it. I forgot, though. I'll talk to you later. And okay, so seems like the glass or wherever it broke is probably near where the kids were playing. All right, uh, Ben, you know anything about this flashlight? A flashlight was broken. Was it you? 
No. You're not in trouble if it was. I know you get nervous, and maybe you went out to go to the bathroom, broke it, got worried, and tossed it. What's with the third degree? I didn't break any flashlight. I'm just okay. saying, Ben. You're not in trouble. I just, I just wanted to know. So it seems like it broke around here. I'm assuming. I, I don't know. Uh, so around here, broken glass. Inspect. So it broke over here. Why do I have a feeling somebody's back here? Look at this. A chalk. Chalk X. <laughs> chalk. So it's chalk. Pink. Hmm. Duck. Duck. A clue. Maybe. What do you think it is? I don't think it's anything. Maybe it's a sign. A sign? It could be. It's pink chalk, which is weird. Okay, back to investigating. <laughs> why, out of all people, did I ask this dude for... Or why did I even let him help me, as the question. Oh, um, let's talk to Clem. Now, Clem, she likes to draw, but I'm, I'm not sure she has anything to do with this. But I'm just going to really talk to her about it. You know, just to see, like, I don't know, maybe, I'm going to ask her if she's seen, like, any suspicious activity about that. Hey, Clementine. Hey, Lee. Do, uh, you have any pink chalk? No, it's gone somewhere. Hmm. Do you want blue? No, no, it's okay. Psst, Lee. What is it, Duck? Please tell me I something helpful. Something. What'd you what find? What is it? I found this piece of pink chalk and a scuff of it over by the gate. Really? Totally. I was coming to see him for clues Yeah, and Duck, I got Okay, it. Duck. Good job. Duck, please don't even go there. All right. <laughs> it's going to be the option to high five Duck. I mean, should I? <laughs> <laughs> You left Duck hanging. I mean, I didn't know I had limited time to freaking. Okay, that was that was kind of mean. I'm not gonna lie. That's that's the number one rule. You never le look. You never leave somebody. Ha you never leave anybody hanging on a high five. I didn't know I had limited time. Okay, my bad. I was going to, but it just it just said I left them hanging. But um, let me show them the flashlight. Oh wait. Oh snap. Um. Oh, you didn't break this flashlight. You didn't break the flashlight, did you, Duck? No, mom and dad won't let me touch any of their stuff. Well, I neither. That's probably for the best. I bet you if I would have high-fived him, I would have gotten an achievement. Found anything else? Have you found anything else? Just the chalk. I also found some bugs underneath the stairs. Don't tell Clementine. Okay, I won't. Stay inside the gate. Oh, I didn't mean to press that. I will, that. I will. But, um, chalk scuff. I don't even see it. Oh, more chalk. So, what exactly could be here around the gate? You seem to know a bit of, you seem to know a bit about all this. You seem to know a bit about all of this. The chalk? You found the scuff here? This is gonna <laughs> sound crazy, but you're not involved, are you? No, I'm a good guy. Stay inside the gate. I will, I will. There's no way Duck can be involved in all of this. Or maybe somebody just accidentally misplaced the chalk. I, I don't know. But I'm starting to have a slow feeling that either someone is behind this or something. Or like, I, I, I don't know, man. Something's going to happen. Okay, let me uh, talk to Kenny about this. Have you seen any chalk around? Ah, uh, yes. Clementine loves to draw with it. Yeah, she says she's missing a piece of it. Well, I don't know anything about that. Sorry, Lee. That's fine. All right. Um. Now let me talk to Ben. Hey, Ben. I need a piece of chalk. You know where I can get any? Why would I have any? Just asking around. Well, I don't play with that stuff. I've got my, well, my thoughts, and I've been reading the Bible I found in my room. That's what it's there for. <laughs> That's something. Still standing God's image. That's good. Um, I've okay. I've already talked to him about it. Let me uh talk to uh, Lily. 
Cause I don't know. I mean, maybe maybe she hasn't seen that yet. Hey. Find anything? Oh, maybe. To, oh wait. Oh, I need to tell you something. I need to tell you something. What is it? Hold on. I was sent to prison before the plague. You think that's news? I guess I hoped it was. Worse. Did you think that story died with my dad? Anything else? No. That was it? Come on now. Wait, can I still tell her about the chalk? Because that, that is something that she needs to know about. Hey. Find anything? Um. Are you worried about morale at all? The darker things get, the more we have to worry about people giving up. Tell me about it. You're worried about people's moods? Have an ice cream social. Do you ever want to leave here? I want to leave here when we have to. Not because of some fantasy of somewhere better. So, you think the coast is a pipe dream? Don't you? We're going to live on the water because we assume they can't swim? We're alive because we've stayed here. That's as far as the discussion needs to go. I'll be back. Oh, well, it seems like she doesn't really know too much about the chalk. I'll talk to Carly about this, because may maybe she knows something about it. Let's go up the stairs. Alright, but still though, I, st I, f I feel kind of bad for leaving Duck on that high five. I shouldn't have done that. Alright, oh, and I, I told Lily. I told Lily. You were right. She and Larry spoke, obviously. It went about as well as you would expect. Do you have any uh, chalk I can borrow? What, Clementine holding out on you? So you don't have any? No, why would I? That's fine. I'm just trying to figure this out right now. Alright, so we're already starting off and we already have like a puzzle or something ahead of us. So it seems, okay, so it seems like this chalk or whatever we got going on here. Okay, the chalk. I, oh, I don't have the chalk. Wait, hold on. Stay inside the gate. I will, I will. Okay. Alright, so we can't really talk to him anymore. So we need to find, we need to find a piece of chalk somewhere. Is there something on the floor here? Wait, oh wait, hold, hold on, hold on. Let me let me go back. So if I go back here with this chalk. What is this? Hopscotch cord. Oh. But where exactly can we find a piece of chalk at? Is there some at this spot right here where Clementine usually draws? Broken glass. Chalk X. What can I what am I supposed to f wait, 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 wait. Did I see something? Hold on. Wait, what is that? Oh, it's just a broken glass. Okay. So, where where can we find some chalk at? Alright, got the RV up and running. Um, I talked to Catch already about this. Let me, uh, let me talk to Kenny real fast. Hi, Lee. Wait, oh, that's it? Hi, Lee. Are you? Okay. Well, seems like we can't really talk much to people. Coming time? Oh, do you have any, do you have any do, pink chalk? Uh, you have any pink chalk? No, it's gone somewhere. Oh, I forgot, Ooh. yeah. Do you want blue? No, no, it's okay. Yeah, I forgot, she doesn't have any pink chalk. Um, however, Duck did say that he found a piece of chalk around here somewhere. But I don't think that's there anymore. Alright, can't go that way. Where could we go from here? Like, are we supposed to find a piece of chalk or something? I don't know. Hey, car. Is it? Oh, man. Alright, so... What are we supposed to do? See, we need to find like okay, we're already like fifty minutes into the episode, and I already don't know what to do. I'm stuck. Is there okay? There has to be chalk around here somewhere. Okay, all I all I see is bricks, drawings, a whole bunch of random junk. Jeez, what are we supposed to do here? I mean, I could talk to Lily more. I can't talk to anybody outside. Um, Ben, I don't know. How's it going, Ben? Still fine. Let's go there. Yeah, so I can't, um, I don't need to talk to anybody else out here. So my only option right now is, uh, we gotta, I gotta figure out what's going on with, uh, Lily. 
Hey. Find anything? I'll be back. What? Okay. Oh, uh, okay. Now, now I'm definitely stuck. So we can't even talk to anybody. We need to figure this out. We need to find something. What are we supposed to find here? No, wait, don't go up the stairs. I didn't mean to go up there. We need to find a piece of chalk. That's what we need to find. Hey, car. But the problem is, I don't know where to look, and duck is not gonna be that much of an answer. I'm trying to, I'm trying to look around somewhere that we haven't uh, looked around before. But wait, he did say you have a pink piece of chalk, but I couldn't even find it. Chalk scuff. What can we do then? <laughs> oh, I can move it. Somebody was over here too. See, I did good, huh? Yeah, Duck, you did. I suppose I should go out there and look around. You stay here this time. Seriously. Okay. Yeah, Duck, I swear to God, do not go out there. You stay there, Duck. I don't want you to get in trouble. Oh, man, I'm outside of the base right now. I should not be doing this right now. Okay, where do I go? So it seems like there's like a chalk... Um, like, I don't know where the chalk was, but for some reason, it was outside. Somebody is here, I'm telling you guys. Oh, it's a, what is this? A grate. What's down There's here? There's a grate down there. Wait, can I, can I open it? What's in here? <clears throat> oh, it's a bag. What's in there? What, what is in this bag? I bet you it's going to be chalk. Oh, it's medicine. Wait, who took that? You haven't okay. come up with anything, have you? Lily was right. I came up with this. It's got a bunch of meds in it. It was in a grate on the outside wall. And there's a sign on the other one. Holy fuck. Yeah. Okay, we line everybody up. Everybody. Somebody is killing us. Stealing from that supply is the same as slipping into your room at night and cutting your throat while you sleep. You die. What is the difference? What if Clementine gets sick and we don't have what we need? What the hell? What's wrong? Fucking steal from us. Oh no! Who the fuck is that? Is that bandits? Got our people out there. Oh no, it's bandits! It's fucking around! What do we do? Oh Lily. shit! They're gonna start kicking in doors any second. Lily, what the hell are you? Stall them. What? Just keep them talking. What do you want me to- Whatever it takes to stop him pulling the trigger. You made the biggest mistake of your life. Okay, so bullshit. it seems like oh Enough no. Enough of this bullshit, Drew. Stop putting your boots in these doors. Yeah. Oh, I'm Move gonna die. Asshole. Take it easy. Take it easy, man. Don't shoot me. Um. Why are you doing this? Just leave us the fuck alone. Why? This fucking guy. Why? Because we gotta. That's why. You gotta. Listen. We'll leave you everything. Just let us walk out of here. So you can try to pay us a little visit, leader? Fuck that! Alright! I've had enough of this shit! Drew! Take these motherfuckers! Oh! Good job! Headshot! We out! Let's go! Are you serious? Oh, get him! You ain't going nowhere, boy. Oh no, I shot him! Oh, there's more? Oh, we're getting attacked! Get back there. Smoke him out. See, this is exactly why we should have left. Oh no, Ben, don't we get shot. Get here. No shit. Yeah, you Bastard. don't say. Cover our people and get them to the RV. See, yep, time to go. Okay. All right, y'all finna get shot. You finna get shot. Oh, it's like I'm playing Call of Duty again. Bop, let's go. Woo! What's up? There. Oh, who coming out next? Pop goes the. Oh, snap. Hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up, and. Come on, peep out, peep out, peep out. Pop goes the weasel. Now, get over here, hurry! <laughs> Let's go. Get inside. Come on, get inside. I'm just fighting them off. Oh, Clementine, come on, we gotta go. Gotcha. Hang on. Uh oh. All right, I got this. Oh, he got bit. I didn't even know that was a walker. Okay. Pop goes the weasel. Pop goes the. Oh. <laughs> Let's go. Oh, sit down. Where you going, boy? Come on. Yo. This game just got a whole lot. Oh no! 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 
Oh, oh, that was close. Catch I almost got bit. That was close. Lily, get in the RV. Screw her. Let her stay. Come on, Lily. Shit. Come on. We got walkers coming in. Bop. Hold up. Bop. Oh. Oh, okay. Switch sides, switch sides, switch sides. You sit down. Hold up, hold up. You sit down. Hold on. Let's go. Bro, it's like I'm playing Call of Duty Zombies. Oh my gosh. Yo! This is crazy! Hold on. Alright, is that everybody? Is, is, are, are we ready to go? Where's Lily? Is Lily with us? Lily, last chance. Get down here. Lily, come on! Lily. Shit. Yeah, we need to go, Lily. Come on. Oh, she got in last minute. Woo! Cat, Jesus, are you okay? I'm fine. I'm fine. Oh, shit. What's up oh, with Doug? I'm sorry. Everything's fine. Oh, Everything's man. not fine. We need to figure out how this happened. We just lost everything. Well, we're lucky as shit to have this RV. And nobody died. Cat's head is split open. I'm fine. Somebody in here calls. Ah. Settle down back there. The bandits have had our number for weeks. This is different. Somebody was working with them. Whoever it was was slipping them our meds. They didn't get their last package, so they attacked. Calm down back there. That's nuts. Lee found a bag of supplies hidden outside the wall. It's true. So, Carly, is there something you want to say? Why would you Please, suspect Carly? We have to get it out of you then. Back off. Don't you are you in dare. no position to make demands. Whoa, whoa, whoa. You're just pointing fingers. Why her? It seems like a stab in the dark, Lily. Exactly. What makes you think Carly do this? She's eager to see what supplies we found. She never talks about her family. She could be related to those bastards for all Whoa, we know. Whoa, my family's not a bunch of meth-riddled forest people. They're fucking Lutheran. You're not saying it wasn't you. It wasn't me. Like, look, maybe we should vote or something like that. Vote? What? Just look. Carly's a stand-up gal, and maybe this was all just a mistake. We need to look at the facts. Let's calm down, we'll eat, and we'll deal with it. Lily, stop waving the finger at everybody. We know something's going on, and we can get to the bottom of it if we keep our heads. I know what we found. I know, Lily. I know. Nobody was stealing anything! Was it both of you? What? I've seen you Why together. Is she... Was it both of you? Look, just let me out. I didn't do it, but I don't like this. I don't like where it's headed. Look me in the eyes and tell me you didn't have anything to do with it. He didn't Lily do it. Off of him. He's innocent. I... Hey. Oh, shit. What's going on up there? I hit something. We got to stop. It was a walker. But Forget it. Just keep driving. It's now then. Oh my gosh. Bro is getting railed by the road. Is it safe? Should be. Everybody out. Lily. Lily, Out. Lily, come on, don't do this. It's a walker. It's I think it's how is it not dead? I can hear it making noises. Look at that thing. It's a walker. Kenny, the RV has some surface damage, but there's a walker trapped underneath. God damn it. Everyone keep your eyes peeled. Okay. Looks you like we're going to be out we on the road. Just kick you out. We should hear what everybody thinks. I think you should chill out. I'm not going to take this. You can push Ben around, but you can't push me around. I'm really sorry you feel that way. I'm starting to think maybe it was both of you. No! Ah, this dumb fuck walker. You okay over you there? You know what? I'm yeah, actually starting yeah. to think she did it. Think man. about it. No because option. why? Oh, There's well. no way she can immediately no, just suspect hard. everybody else. Everything will be right as rain. I think she probably did it. Lee, what the fuck? Wait, oh, snap. Okay, no, 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 no. I didn't mean to. Okay. Oh, snap. I didn't I mean know. to say that. Fuck. Just stop, would you? I didn't well, mean you to say that. For you and Katja. We don't need all these votes. What do I have to do for you to I, I thought I'll I was talking anything. about freaking... I'll, I'll do watches for months. Ha, the hell you will. I'll get more food, more medicine, anything. He's broken, Lily. I can see that. Do we need any more evidence than this? Fuck evidence. Stop treating him like this. Shut up, Carly. Ugh, I've heard enough out of you. Kenny, what's it gonna be? Just give me a damn minute. Ben. 
then. You have until that walker is dealt with to tell me it was her and not you. I didn't mean Stop to do this. that. You're torturing him. No, Leave him alone. Man. Stop. This is about trust, and I've never trusted you. Tell her. Just do it, Ben. Wait, Jesus, well, who are you right tell now? Tell her what? She'll kick me out of the group. I don't know what to we say. Will, we'll understand. Tell me. Now. There. I got him. He's, let's just get back That's in the That's not RV. happening. You think you're some tough bitch, don't you? Like nothing can hurt you. But you're just a scared little girl. Get the fuck over it. Take Damn. a page from Lee's book and try helping somebody for once. She's gonna snap. Now, what the fuck's the problem? Oh! No! Kari! Oh my! Drop it. You little! Kenny! What's happening? Keep duck away from the windows! Jesus Christ! Get in! We're leaving this crazy bitch. She couldn't be trusted, Lee. I swear. You're not coming with Lee. us. Mm -mm. You're not coming with us. No, I can't. No, don't we die out here. I don't care. You're a murderer, Lily. We can't have you with us. I'm a murderer. You've had Lee with you this whole time. I don't care what he did before. If we keep you with us, how long until you get me? I was trying to protect. No, Anna. Carly. Uh, no. Get in, Lee. Let's go, you guys. Oh my, Lily. Oh my gosh. You deserve to be left here, Lily. I don't even care if I made the wrong decision, but Lily does not deserve to be with us. Oh, and would you look at that? Walker right behind her. Lee? Oh my god. Word, please. Carly. Oh. Let me talk to Clementine. Maybe she can help okay. me get over this. Katya needs you for something. I know, I know. Oh. What's up? Is Duck feeling all right? What's wrong with Duck? Is he breathing? <gasps> no! Fuck. Happened during the raid. No. He's gonna turn. We don't know that. Gotcha. What do we really know? None of us have been bitten. We don't know what the time frame is for a child. We know nothing. I'm going to monitor him and focus on the wound and see if his condition changes. We keep the same plan unless something changes. East. Guys. What else is there to do? We thought you should know. Bro. To stay honest with each other. Anyway. If you could tell Clementine, we would appreciate it. Okay, got you. One bad- Bro, no! Why is so much bad stuff happening already? We lost Carly, and Duck has been bitten! Oh, oh man! What, do we, what can we even do here? Golly, well, I mean, luckily we have one murderer off our hands, but we're gonna have a whole walker in the car in the next 15 minutes or so. However long it's gonna take for him to turn. But I guess we gotta let Clementine we gotta tell her everything. Duck is bitten. Huh? He got bit by a walker trying to escape the motel. I don't feel good. What about Carly? gone but won't come back because she was shot in the head that's right it's horrible yeah it is <sighs> what does this episode turn to a 
glad I have you. Me too. I heard you outside my treehouse that day and thought about dropping a hammer on your head. What? Why? In case you were up to no good. Oh. Before you, there was this other guy. He was yelling and trying to get into my house. He wanted to take the TV and tried to break the glass door with a rock. Then some walkers came and scared him away. The door was open. He was dumb. <sighs> Wait, don't tell- Duck? Duck? <sighs> He's turned, has he? No! Oh! Oh! Bro, it was a nightmare. Oh my gosh. Oh! Oh! Bro. This game better not ever do that again. I literally thought Clem was bit. Damn it. Bro. If, the, bro, if Clem was bit at that point, I would have just ended the whole series there. That would have made me so mad. Oh my gosh. Yo, that scared me so bad. Oh my gosh. Yo, chat, tell me I'm not the only one who got who actually thought Clem got bit. Is there any way to get around it? Doesn't look like it. On foot, maybe. Can't really afford to do that now. This seems like a safe area. All this brush will stop anything from creeping up on us. And I know what they were trying to do there because when Clem said I don't feel so good, they were trying to make us think that he got bit. That that Clem got bit by duck. Why don't you and I go look around? Yeah, everyone else relax. Clem, stay close to Kenny and Cat, okay? Lee, if you come across anything to drink, uh, if there's a dining car or something, I think Duck's a bit dehydrated. It's a freighter, huh? Be careful in there. What? You think there might be something dangerous inside an abandoned locomotive? That would cross my mind. Question is, when is Duck gonna turn? Because I know eventually he's gonna turn. Okay. Uh, what we got up in here? Oh my gosh. Oh, we got shoe outlets. Whoa. Somebody's been living in here. Yeah, man. Shit. Think they're gone? I hope so. But this looks recently used. Be on the lookout and have your guard up. Oh, man. Ooh, water. Oh, um, Duck needs this. For Duck. Yeah, let me, let me give this to Duck. What's this? Oh, we got a map. Nice. A map of where the train goes. I think these tracks might lead to the coast. Route 27, Savannah. That's where Kenny's got us headed. Ah, nice. Okay. That's good to know. All right, before we head on out, I, I want to... Is there anything else in here? No, no, no. Okay. Let's go to this door. Hopefully it opens. Oh, it opens. Alright, what we got up in here? Right, an engine compartment. Mm, do you even do we know? How, I mean, I don't know how trains work. Nothing. Yeah, I don't know how this stuff works. Hopefully, uh, Kenny knows what he's doing. What on here? It says, ooh, a spike remover. That could be that could be useful for a weapon. I'm gonna need that. Look at this. Oh, look at these other weapons. Oh, we we're gonna have to choose a weapon. So we got a spike remover, a spanner, and a monkey wrench. Now a monkey wrench is a pretty lethal weapon, but that spike remover though. Actually, no no no, we're going for the monkey wrench. This is probably a lot more useful. 
Yeah, let's take this one. Monkey wrench definitely is a it's a more heavy and dense lethal weapon. So we'll definitely take that. Unless there are some other weapons in this compartment and the third one over here. Or yeah, yeah, the third one. What's in here? Any more weapons? Nothing much. Mm, nothing. Alright, what about the fourth one? It's gonna be like a weapon or like uh some ammo, something. I'm hoping at least. Nothing. Okay. That's nothing. What do we got here? Cab door. <gasps> Shit. Oh no, it's a walker. We got one. It's a walker. walker. Sitting in the chair. We got him. Aha. Oh no, okay, I'm not I'm not gonna use my gun. I'm gonna use my what's it called? My monkey wrench. Alright, come on. Alright, ready? Alright, just bop him in the head. Bop him in the head. Ready? Oh! Oh, it was already dead. Yeah. Is it dead? Yo, please don't bite me. Yeah, yeah, he dead, dead. Okay. We're good. Okay. I don't think this guy came back. Christ. Yeah, he definitely didn't. That light is blinking. Push it. Push it? Why not? Are you fucking serious? Here, look. Oh, the train. I think he uh, has it all running. The brakes. Okay, I'll give you that. Okay. This fucker works? Seems like it. I'll be damned. How the hell do we get it moving? I don't know. That's Mr. Amtrak over here. No clue. Oh. We found this in the boxcar back there. Whoa, is this what it looks like? I think so. This hoss will take us right to Savannah. A hundred tons of steel. Put a thousand walkers between us and the ocean, and we don't have to give a shit. I can't believe it. <laughs> we just have to figure out how to get it started. Well, actually, what about Duck? What about Duck? What about him? We can't act like nothing happened to him. We can't act like he's dead either. Okay, fair enough. Try to get sure. this thing started. There's got to be some sort of manual or something. <laughs> I don't know about that. That's the spirit. Ben, if you could keep an eye on the girls and duck, I'd appreciate it. I'm gonna make sense of these controls. Nah, yeah, probably so. Man, this could be exactly what we need. Nice, okay. Map bin, photograph. Um, I still want to give the water to uh, Duck, though. I want to give the water to him. Because I know, bro, is, he is just madly dehydrated right now. However, I'm still on the lookout once he turns. Because it's going to happen eventually. I'm calling it right now. All right, let me give this to Duck. All right, where is he? Oh, here he is. Here, found some water. Oh, thank you. He's Jeez. allergic to bees. Is that right? That's all I can keep thinking about. Like, somehow that matters. It doesn't. I know. Well, I don't. But you're probably right. That's true, that's true, that's true. Alright, Katja is thankful for your help. That's good to know. You know, it's good to know that she can still trust me after everything that I've done in the past. Hey, sweet pea. You okay out here? I don't think Duck feels good. Yeah, me neither. I don't know, man. Bro was probably heating up so bad. I got no idea how to get the engine started. That guy in the cab probably knew. Yeah, well, he isn't talking. Well, he had to learn it somewhere. Maybe there's a manual somewhere. There's gotta be. Yes, okay, so you already been in there. Um... I think there was something in that uh, map bin where Kenny was. Okay, okay, okay. Oh, man. I'm, s I'm starting to think that, um, I don't know. I just, I really, do I'm really, I'm not, uns I'm, I don't really feel so sure about Duck. A bunch of maps about Georgia cities. Nothing about the train. 
Oh, oh, it's a notepad. Shit, this is it. Instructions on starting the engine. It's, Damn, yeah. Pages are gone. Pages are gone. I can kind of see the indentations from the writing. Find a way to read the notepad. Rotten lunch. Ugh. <laughs> so the same thing. Um, so it seems like we need to find, we need to find a way to read it. How exactly do we do that? Hey, Kim. What's up? Um, I don't know about leaving Lily back there. We need something to help us get this train going. And we need some help getting this train going. People take notes, right, when working on stuff like this? Uh, we're smart guys. We can figure it out. We need some, um, ooh. um, what's it called? I don't know about leaving. No, no, no. See, Lily, she deserved what happened back there. You want to talk about that? I'm really sorry, Kenny. Nobody deserves this. There's nothing to talk about. You heard Cat. He could be fine. We probably shouldn't ignore it. Nobody's ignoring nothing. I'm not worried. You shouldn't be either. Okay. So. And we need some help getting oh, this yeah, train I said going. That. People take notes, right, when working on stuff like this. Uh, we're smart guys. We can figure it out. So it really does seem like we need to find something. I'll get back to it. Me too. Okay, I mean, if I just mess around with the controls, it's not even going to do much. No idea what to do with these. Like, how do you start a train? Um, anything? The notepad. We're just missing some notes. Photograph. Okay, so this, I believe, is who the train belonged to. Nothing about the train. Okay. So maybe maybe the instructions are somewhere in the other side of the train. Maybe I don't know, but it did say we need to find something to help read. Or yeah, we need to find something to try to read it. And there's nothing in all these crates. Okay, we can't go on these two. But um, what else can we find? Anything in here that's useful? A wrench. I don't even know. Those are just weapons. Those aren't even gonna do much. Okay, so we need to find well, what what exactly um can we use to help read it? What can we use? This switch does nothing. Yeah, that switch does nothing. Nothing. So it seems like I don't like what can we find? Do we need to find like other pages or something? I don't know. Okay, let me go down. It's gotta be something in that other part of the train. The door to the boxcar. Oh wait, um, do I need to? No, I'll just go from. No, no, no. I'll I'll go from here. Okay, doesn't seem like much though. Yeah, it is not much. No notes. No. I was hoping we could find some notes back here. Oh, you can go this way. You can go the other way. I didn't even know that. Okay. Got this, got that. Oh, what's this? Um, it's a pin. Okay, we need to disconnect that. Ooh, I'm not stuck. I can definitely pry this thing free. If I can break it loose first. Break it loose. That's a a pin. Um oh maybe we need another tool. Maybe that's what we need. Okay, hold on. I'm um let, okay, so we need to get the other tool. I believe we gotta get the spike remover. Maybe that's uh useful for like prying it out or something. I don't know. All right, let's go to that. All right, we're making progress though. We're making a lot of progress. Chad, how are you feeling about this so far? Now, even though the episode did start off pretty bad because you know we lost Carly thanks to Lily, and honestly, I'm glad we got rid of Lily because. I didn't want her to kill anybody else, and I did not want her throwing a fit at anybody else. So either way, she was a massive, massive problem in the group. So anyways, maybe it's this thing we need to use. A spike remover. All right, let me see if this works. Maybe this will work. It's got to. Because I, I can tell the wrench is not going to do anything. Or maybe it is. I don't know. But we'll have to see. Okay. So right now we just gotta get rid of this. Um, you have to unlock something or whatever it is. I don't know. Okay. Let's get this over there. Okay, okay, okay. Oh man. 
I'm still mad though that this stream started a little bit late. Okay, does this work? Still? It's stuck. We need a bunch of force to break away all this rust and whatnot before I can pry anything free. Yeah, that wrench isn't gonna do anything. Well, I guess we can come up here. Shit. Broken. Okay, can I not? Oh, I thought I could come up the ladder. Okay, I can't. Wait. What'd that do? Oh, okay. That doesn't do anything. Yeah, I can't even use my hand. There's gotta be a better way to do this. Do I need like a... Oh, it's... Oh, train wheels. So what am I supposed to find? Like, am I supposed to find something? I don't even know what I'm supposed to be looking for right I'm now. Get it over there. Hold on. I have no idea. Mm, we need to find something. Um, what other tools do we have? There are no other tools that we can. Oh, a sheet metal. That's one hell of a mess. Jeez. There's gotta be something we can use. Mm, hold on. Oh wait, wait, wait. I think um, I'm sure Kenny um doesn't know that there's something like. Holding the freaking train that's together or there's something jamming it. I, plus, I don't even know we can go over here oh, What we got over here is, is there something over here like could we go down this way? Oh I can't okay Okay We got a problem what we still got the rest of the train attached to us back there shit I tried to yank the pin out, but it won't budge well, we ain't going anywhere until it does. Okay, so what can we use though? Like, what exactly can we use to pry that out? Cause like none of the tools are working, and I bet you that wrench isn't gonna do anything either. I mean, unless we try. Jeez. Oh my gosh! Oh, oh man! All right. Well, Aiden, the the second you got back, we freaking got jump scared. Oh my god, this game has so many tricks. First, it literally scared me into thinking that Clem was bit, and now they throw a cheap freaking walker jump scare. Oh, this game. Is there something? Oh, there's something in there. Uh, I don't want to use my gun. Car door. Door's closed. Door's closed. Animal crackers. Should I use my gun? That timing was good timing. I don't want, if I use my gun, it's going to cost a lot of noise, but I have to kill it. Animal crackers, seatbelt buckle. I thought those things were designed to save lives. You know what? I'm just going to go for it. It's going to attract, the, it's going to make some noise, but I hope it doesn't make too much noise. YOLO! Oh, oh okay, good, okay. I was going to say. Alright, open the door. Right, I got to kill this thing. Oh, what the? This door's going to hurt. Okay, so what do you want me to do? There we go. Hit the walker. Hit it. Come on, man. Dude. Dude. Do I have to unbuckle it? You aren't gonna like this. Alright, come on. There we go. Alright, now hit it. Hit it. Hit it. Hit it. Hit it. There we go. There you go. Good job. Hey, what was it? Hey, man, I gotta say, I really like that you are streaming nightly because now you have constant content. Exactly. Because if I was doing this in the daytime, I will be knocked out right now. Got some animal crackers back there, but that's not gonna... It's nothing useful. I don't even know who I can give that to. All right, so we got a walker dead, which was... It, it, that was an extremely cheap jump scare, I gotta say. So anyways, um... What's this? A cow catcher. It's in pretty good shape for a wreck. I did what the heck is a cow catcher? I've never heard of that. So I got some animal crackers. Um, should I give these to Duck? I don't know. I mean, because he, he really seems like he needs water. I don't really think he needs something to eat at right now at the moment. But uh, maybe I can lend these to somebody. Let me see. Oh, no, I can't. Oh, oh, I can. Oh, I actually can give him the animal crackers. There we go. Here, I found these. If Duck's up for it. Thank you. That's very thoughtful. He isn't fussy, you know. What? Most kids, they're really fussy about what they'll eat. Hate vegetables, that kind of thing. Not duck, huh? No. The most trouble I ever have is making him use a fork. <laughs> Thank you, Lee. Sure. 
Um, you could make an edited together version of these streams to YouTube. Actually, yeah. Um, right now at the moment, um, my first, the first episode is right now uploading, which is going to take quite a long time to upload because the file is pretty big and the quality is going to take a while to process. So don't worry for those who don't, uh, watch these on Twitch. Um, feel free to watch it on my YouTube channel. Um, like one whole season edited together. Oh, that's gonna take too much work and that's gonna take up too much space. I can't do a whole season together, but I can make um each I, I can make each season separate. You know what I mean? This is only season one, so I only have certain parts of season one. So that's not gonna be possible. But I'll have certain parts of each and every single episode separated and organized. But just keep that in mind. Like um one whole season together and shortened to make it better for YouTube. It's a funny edit. Yeah, I'll be doing a montage sooner or later. I'll be doing that. Like um my Twitch highlights and stuff like that. Cause right now I'm just gathering a whole bunch of clips for you know like on, on Twitch right now. I'm just gathering a whole bunch. Um, I'm gathering a whole bunch of uh, clips right now. Yeah, I'm just saying if you got time and if you want to do it, if you want to do it big after you get after you beat a season, definitely, man, for sure. So, yeah, that's that is definitely on the I have so much on the to do list right now. You don't even know. So anyways, we got some animal crackers, but we still need to figure out. So we need to figure out how to freaking get rid of this little uh, part in the back. Only problem is we don't know what to do. There's nothing we could find. Um, what is there to find? I'm so confused. Is there something that we're missing? I don't know. Chat, let me know. See, I feel I, I know we're missing something. I just don't know what it is. And this is extremely strong. Yeah, we cannot pry this. We can't pry this. Stuck. We need a bunch of force to break away all this rust and whatnot before I can yeah. pry anything free. You know what? I'm gonna go. Tr I'm gonna try the wrench anyway, just cause. I mean, it's probably not gonna do much, but it's it's better than nothing. I've tried the monkey wrench and I've tried the spike uh, remover multiple times, and that hasn't done anything. So I'm just gonna try the wrench just cause. All right, sounds good, man. This is gonna this is gonna be getting you back into the YouTube game. I'm sure you will get to a thousand subs soon if you keep this up. Hey, man, that's well. Right now, the main goal is 500, but the biggest goal right now for the biggest milestone is 1,000 subscribers. Definitely for sure. Did you kill the zombie car? Yeah, I did, and I got some animal crackers for duck. So we killed the zombie in the car. We did that, and right now we're still trying to figure out how to remove that little uh, piece behind the train so we can so we can get the train moving. So yeah, man, 1,000 subscribers. And on top of that, for anybody, for all of you guys watching that, well, it's not a lot of people. Like I said, it doesn't matter. But for those of you that are watching right now, the least you, the least you could do right now is subscribe to me on my YouTube channel. And you know, it really supports it really supports me, and it really helps this community as well, man. So that's the least you guys can do. That'd be greatly appreciated. Okay, so let me. I'm gonna I'm gonna just try the wrench. It's probably not gonna it's probably not gonna work, but I gotta try something, man. Because I am generally stuck. I don't know what to do. And we've looked almost everywhere. Um, are you going to have ads on your stream when you could put them in? See, now, I know a lot of people hate ads. So, I don't really know about ads. I mean, that's I know that's how you make revenue on Twitch. But, you know, I don't want to, like, make anybody torture through that. Stuff like that. But, I mean, people can also donate. Keep that in mind. If you also really want to support me, the, the least you could do is donate. Now, donations aren't... An, Donations aren't necessary, but they are greatly appreciated. It's stuck. We need a yeah, bunch of force to break away all this rust and whatnot before I can pry anything free. Yeah, I called it. That is not gonna work. We need to. What else can we? What can we use to pry this thing open? I wouldn't mind watching them if it gets you that bag. Definitely, man. I mean, I appreciate that, man. But like I said, the like the least you guys can do to also support me as well is by donating. You can donate as much or as literal. The amount does not matter. But if you want to support me and help me with better YouTube videos and streams and content, that's the least you can do. But it's your call. If you want to go for max viewing, Kate, or for max viewing ease. So, anyways, um, I'm trying to figure this out. Oh, RV door. Maybe there's something in the RV. There's got to be something. Um, anything in the RV? Alright, wait, what am I looking at? No, it's not. Oh, wait. Oh, a pencil. A pencil. Sharp and two. Can I, oh, can I pick it up? Pick it up. It could be useful. Um, and what else can I do? Um, anything else in here? 
All I found was a pencil, that was it. I thought that was a lead pipe, the console. Um, who would thought uh who would thought that Lily might be worse than Larry? I was not expecting that. Literally, she literally reached her limit. Like and like on top of that, why would everybody when a person when a certain person gets roasted or whatever, why do they have the need to pull out a weapon other than then other than just using their hands? Like Lily, she got offended so bad. Her ego was hurt so bad that she really needed to do that. That really just that really comes to show how much of a wish she really is. Like that is just ridiculous. But yo, rip Carly though, man. We, I'm, I'm going to miss her, man. So anyways, I found a pencil. I don't know what I could do with it. But um, the only thing I am thinking about, since I have a pencil and we have a notepad, I mean, am I supposed to write something? Like, what should I do? I, I really don't know. Um, What can I do? Oh, I actually can. Well, what can I write? Perfect. Oh, yeah, nice! To be able to just follow the steps to get the engine on. Sounds good. Okay. Nice. I didn't even know that. Wow. That is so smart. Um, we tried to kick out Duck, but he generally, but he generally thought he was bitten and wasn't just making up, making things up for no reason. Oh man, I really hope that doesn't happen, but. Anyways, that is so smart. I, there's no way I would have been able to figure that out, even if I had a pencil. But he just went for it. So, anyways. Hey, Ken. What's up? I don't know about leaving. Well, actually, no, no, no. Um, I'm working on starting this thing, actually. With the directions I was able to piece together, I, I think I might be able to get this thing started. Uh, I don't know. It's a long shot. I don't even know what the fuel situation is with this thing. We'll find out. You mess around in the engine compartment yet? For real though, 200 IQ. That is crazy. All right then. Yep. Lee is that smart. So anyways, um, I still got the notes. So let's go to the control. Well, actually, here. Um, let me use this thing. So use a notepad with the console. So what does that mean? Okay, 6599. Nine. So hold on, hold on. So I think what we need to... So, oh, these are the numbers. So 6599. Nine. Six five nine nine. Okay, so it's all organized. So six. Okay, so so six five nine nine. Okay. Okay, so hold on, guys. This, it's like a puzzle. This is so confusing. Okay, um, so I'm have to look back at this every single time. So flip the switch. Wait. Uh, the Lee you are playing is the kind you want in your group. Strong, smart, caring, and a good leader. For real though, man. That is facts. So anyways, I think we need to flip the switches. Flip. So down, down, up, 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 down, up. Down. Alright. So down, down, up. Uh-huh. Up, up. And then... what? Wait, what is it? It is... Um, wait, wait. Oh, snap. I didn't mean to do that. Hold on, hold on. Wait, uh, see, geez, these controls. So then up, down, up. Okay, got it. Up, down, up. Up, down, up. Here we go. Alright. Nice. Son of a bitch. Whatever you did, lit the dash up. So far, so good. Okay. So now, what's this? Is there something we have to do with five, I believe? Alright, so what we got here? So... Turn that one, and that goes by itself. Okay, so what do I do here? So it's just like this, I believe. Like this? Now we're talking. Oh, simple. Okay, so now, what we got now? What we got? Where's number nine at, though? Where's number nine? So... So nine... What do we do here? This is confusing. Okay, maybe that's out. Oh, wait, it's a switch. That's a switch outside. Okay, okay, that's a switch. All right, that's in here. All right, we're getting somewhere. I mean, hey, we got a long road ahead of us anyway, so I'm sure we got this. Okay, so wait, 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 wait. How's it go? So left, right. Okay, so you turn it left and then right. Okay, we got this. So left. Uh-huh, there we go. And then, right. 
There we go. Let's go. We got the train running. Holy shit. We're golden. Um, duck though. I don't know. What about duck? What about it? Look, Kitty. It's something we're gonna have to deal with. Did you not hear, Cat? We don't know shit, Lee. Let's fucking enjoy this. I don't know, Kenny. Mom, I mean, let's see if she'll move. I mean, Kenny, you don't really seem too amused by this. Okay. Is everything ready to go? Oh wait, we still gotta get that it's thing behind. Oh, nice. Okay. So here we go. Hey, it's my oh. Damn it. So we gotta get that move. We're still attached. Can you go find out where we're stuck? Get us unstuck? Yeah. Okay, but how are we supposed to get rid of that thing? We don't know what to use. Like, I don't know what to do. Yeah, I forgot. We were still attached to that thing. We gotta get rid of this. Maybe I... Wait, can I talk to Ben? Maybe, maybe, maybe he can help me with this. I don't know. Oh, man. Have you heard or seen anything out here? No sign of whatever lives in the train. Keep it down. I don't want you scaring the kids. Okay. Coming time? You okay? Hey, sweet pea. You okay out here? She's just upset about Duck. I don't think Duck feels good. Uh, me neither. Oh, man. I swear. Duck better not. I mean, he got bit. Otherwise, I mean... He did get bit, so there's a high chance he's going to turn. So anyways, we still need to figure out how to get that unhooked. But there's uh, there's nothing I can... How am I supposed to unhook this thing? What can I do here? I have All I have is a rent. I cannot get this thing unhooked. Wait. Oh! It works now! There we go! Nice! Hey, Kenny, we're loose! Nice, we're good to go. Uh, he got bitten and still has the bitten limb, so it's not looking good. Yeah, I'm I'm worried about Duck. I just I know eventually he's gonna turn. I know it's gonna happen. You touch any of my stuff? Oh. Okay, there is somebody here. My guy, I don't want no problems. Um, who are you? Who are you? My guy who owns that stuff. Guess it's no worse for wear. Name's Chuck. Chuck. Charles, if you fancy. Lee. That your crew outside? Yeah. And the guy up in the cab. Him too. I saw you walking through here and thought about scaring the pants off you. What? But I couldn't force myself to do it. My bad. I didn't mean I, I didn't mean to leave him on a high five. Still I didn't mean to. Freaking me out. Train folk will do that. Already met everyone outside. They all warm to me right quick in direct sunlight. You met Chuck. Yeah, I did. You know who so that nice is? To meet someone normal for a change. He gave us candy, Ben too. Oh. <laughs> you do you, Ben. At least he's actually helping. Uh, what's your game, man? What's your game? Keeping alive. I don't know, man. I like it. You met Kenny? Sure did. Man shares my love of the road. That's for sure. <coughs> oh, Doug, please. I'm awful sorry your son's not feeling good. I appreciate your concern. Well, with a little TLC, I'm sure he'll be fit as a fiddle in no time. And I can offer y'all whatever I got, although it ain't much. Thank you. We'd like to do the same. Why don't we hold off on that? Stay with us. We'd like the company. I mean, he seems normal. No bites, no nothing. And he's only one guy. Oh, look at him playing the guitar. Talk to him real fast. Hey, Honey. Where are you from? You live around here? Georgia boy. You saw where I live. Georgia. Why are you alone? Why not? 
seem to be doing all right. Fine, man. Yeah, bro, just, you just getting I'm straight sorry. to the point. I do like being around y'all, actually. It's nice. It's fine. You caught us on a bad day. Mm. You still got a couple of kids, and this one's got a good spirit. Really good spirit. That's some kind of something. I'll talk to you later. Hope so. Okay, um, I think we're all ready to go. Hold on, I want to talk to everybody though. Hey, sweet pea. That candy Chuck gave you. It taste okay? It was really good. No funny aftertaste? No. Not funny aftertaste? Yeah, I just want to make sure. It's cool, huh? I guess. Scary, kind of. I need to be scared. I've actually never rode on a train before. How you doing, Ben? I'm watching the girls and not working on a mega cool train. What do you think? Okay, jeez. I mean, why does he sound kind of rude? Um, how's Duck? How's Duck? I don't know. Tired. Which could mean a lot of things, right? Yeah. His body's probably fighting whatever's in it. Exactly. Oh, man. Would you have left Lily back there? On the side of the road like that? Yes, Lee. Yeah? We have to have lines. Yes, I would have left her. That's good to know. Okay, then. Has Clementine said anything to you about Carly or Duck or anything? I'm worried about her. No. That little girl is a puzzle. Yeah, she is. Poor Carly. God, where did yesterday go? Poor Carly, though. I man. don't know. Are you okay? I know you were fond of her. I was. This isn't any time for, you know, romance, but yeah. I was, uh, fond of her, yeah. Anyway, let me know if anything changes here. Rest in peace, Carly. She, like, cause she, cause she died in the pettiest way possible. So that's it? We're cut loose? Seems that way, yeah. Great. Alright, time to we go, don't guys. We much left, so just gather whatever you have. Let's go. Wanna ride? Well, it sounds like you're taking my home. That's a yes, then. And find anything better for keeping the creepy crawlies out than that boxcar. <laughs> Time to go, guys. Duck's sick. Get on the train, Clementine. Yeah, I don't know, Kenny. Kenny doesn't really seem to be amused by this. Let me look at him. Yeah, he's getting a lot sicker. You guys see his eyes? Is the train really a good idea? We can keep going if you want. Damn right I won't. That's what we're doing. I think Lee just wants to talk it through. It's talked through! Get home, Kent. I'll be up front. I don't want to hear any nonsense until we get where we're going. Yeah, I'm starting to I'm starting to think Kenny's not really seeing this whole he's not he's not really taking this whole situation serious. Come on, Kenny. Alright, time to go. guys I mean his own son is destined to die I don't blame him for not wanting to believe it I understand that but you gotta you gotta see the reality of the situation everybody's worried about him oh man all right we're picking up some speed <sighs> But hey, I'm starting to feel safe though, you know, we got a long road ahead of us and, you know, we should be fine. I'm feeling safe. I know, maybe Lee will be able to talk some sense into him, I hope. Or maybe, well, we're, we're gonna have to talk to some sense, we're gonna have to talk some sense to him. On you, eh? Three adults, taking care of three kids. No disrespect, son. 
Wow. We'll be fine. We've gone through just as much as anybody else. This one's gonna grow up quick. I already am. I don't doubt it, son. Lee. Oh. Lee, oh you. no. Oh 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 no no no. What? Duck. Duck. My hands are full too. Duck. Oh my God. Duck. Wait. What do I do here? Oh, a rag. Thank you. Could you just get that off his face, please? Bro is bleeding. He's out of time. We need to stop this train. Okay. Please. Oh, Jesus. What do we do? We're, we're losing a kid over here. Oh, man. All right, we, we're probably going to have to stop the train sooner or later. Go get Kenny. Hold on tight in case the train stops fast. Okay. I got to go. Okay, I got to go over here. Yeah, they really trying to make you cry this episode. They really are. This is only episode. This is episode three. We're halfway through season one. Okay. I just we, we're gonna have to stop the train. Please, I hope he understands. You need to stop the train. You need to stop it. Where's where's the thing? I I can control it. Oh, talk to Kenny. Okay. Wait, hold up, hold up, hold up. Um, Duck just gone back there. Gotcha, need you, Kenny. Duck will be fine. Wake the fuck up, man. This is over. He's dead. Don't you tell me to wake up. I got a real family I'm trying to protect. Not that fucking sham you're running back there. Kenny, come on, don't do this to me. I don't know what's wrong with them. I'm not gonna fight him. I'm not, no. I don't know what the hell is wrong with you, but you need to lock it up. Be a man here. Oh, you want a piece of me? Is that it? Kenny, stop. Listen, I'm not trying to fight you. I just want to talk, Ken. Relax. Then talk. What is the goddamn deal? He's a little sick, but we can't just quit. It's a scratch. He's not like the others. Jesus, all y'all are just making it worse. You have to stop the train. You're in denial. You're in denial. And you've given up on Duck, on everyone. Stop it, goddammit. Stop the train. Fuck you, Lee. You Kenny. Or what? Kenny. Don't make me do this, Kenny. Please don't make me do this. Knock this off. Rillo, knock this off. Knock this shit off. So, you want to fight then? No, I don't. I don't want to fight him. I really don't want to fight him, bro. Let's just talk, man. Whatever. You think you're the reason Duck was bitten? You could have just... You think you're the reason Duck was bitten? Like you had this coming or something? You didn't kill her, son. You need to get over it. Stop thinking about yourself, man. You feel guilty. Like you killed any chance of a miracle for Duck when you ran away from Sean Green. There's no room for that shit. This isn't about you. It's about a woman back there who needs her husband and a boy who needs his dad. Exactly. Think about this, Kenny. All right, stop the train. Yeah, I wasn't trying to fight him. That's the thing. All right. I was not trying to fight him. Slowly Ken, hearing, it's. I think it's time. Don't tell me he's dead. Please, don't be dead. The boy's been bit. In case you haven't figured that out. Take as long as you need. Take as long as you need. There ain't no time left to take. What are we gonna do? We can't allow him to become one of those things. But what if... what if he doesn't? Kenny, I love you very much. 
I love our son more than life itself. I need you to hear me. What you are saying, that he may not turn, is foolish. But... No. There's... Come on, Cat. If you think of one, you let me know. Isn't there some sort of pill or something we can just give him? Stop it. Just drift off to sleep. Right, hon? I mean, Jesus, this is our son. I know. But we know it's here or nothing. Oh, fuck. Just who, then? You want me to? You don't have to. I'll do it. No, you don't have to. I'll do it. No, it should be a parent. No parent should have to do something like this. He's right, Cat. We can say our goodbyes and just let that be it. I don't know. Lee, you'd be doing this family a great service. Why don't we take him into the forest so Clementine doesn't have to see? Yeah. Give us a moment to say goodbye. Of course. I'm gonna make sure he's okay. But how? He's bitten. By making sure he doesn't come back. Oh. Look, Clem. Things are... <gasps> what the? No! Ben, take Clementine into the what train. What just happened? Go. It'll wait, be wait, 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 wait. Hold on, man. What happened? What just happened back there? Kenny? Jeez, my hands. She just why cat honey oh fucking god oh my <laughs> god cats <laughs> what the hell happened what did you she could she 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 just oh, oh, oh fuck No. No. Wait. Oh. What do we do? You're his dad. You gotta do this. Just put an end to it, man. I can't do it. I, I can't. It has to be done, but I can't do it. I'm by my own hands. I can't do it. Can't do it. Can't do it. It'll be okay. It'll be okay. Oh my gosh.
What has this episode turned into? This is a tragedy. Why would you even say that? Hey, how you doing? I don't care what reasons you had for doing it. No reason to go and tell my girl she's gonna end up dead. Cause she is. No, she's not. Don't say that. I don't know much about you folks, but I can tell you as sure as the sun's gonna come up tomorrow. Y'all keep going on like this, and that girl ain't gonna make it. What do you know? I know that you don't have a goddamn plan. We get to Savannah, and then what? I figure it out. No. We do what's best for Clementine. Oh, well then, you do have it all figured out. Never mind. Look, sit down with the girl and hash it out. Find a map, for Christ's sake. I'd give you one if I had it. And if something were to happen to you... It won't. If it were, you gotta prepare the girl. Teach her to use a weapon, and for crime, and he cut that hair. Like a gun. Are you kidding me? What, she's too young to handle one? There ain't too young. Not anymore. You gotta consider her a living person. That's it. You're either living or you're not. You ain't little, you ain't a girl, you ain't a boy. You ain't strong or smart. You're alive. Look at her hair. Find some scissors in my pack and take care of that hair before a walker does it for you. And then show her how to use a gun. Because like it or not, that's what saves your life from here on out. I don't mean to tell you how to do your job. But too many people have died already. They have. And seeing another little girl die might just... Do me in. I hear you. A plan, a haircut, and a gun. It's good advice. It's something. Where are you headed? Uh, that way. I mean when we get to Savannah. You got a few ideas. We'll have a talk when we get there. About whether or not you folks want company. You have any family? Out there somewhere. Been sort of on my own for the past, oh, 14 years now. Sorry to hear that. No one to blame. Don't be spoiling stuff in the chat now. You're homeless then? Eh, suppose. I've had homes here and there, and they just don't work out. I like a drink, you know? Yeah. Got any? No. Darn. Kenny ended up shooting his son out there. I suppose someone had to. What a mess. You said it. Be safe up here. You betcha. Oh, man. I... Hold on. I gotta talk to Kenny. Because I know... He, I know he's not doing the best right now. He lost hey, his whole hey. family. You and me, we... Let's just get to the ocean. You still want to get a boat? It's still the best plan. Can. It's the best plan. Oh, man. Oh, there's a map in here. Mind if I get by you for a second, Kenny? Can you just leave me alone? Okay, maybe I can't get the map. But, um, I guess, uh, I mean, he is right, though. We gotta... We gotta help Clem. We gotta teach her how to survive. We we gotta teach her. And possibly give her a haircut. I mean I'm not a I'm not a barber or a hairstylist, but I mean it's the least we could do for her safety. Let's talk to Ben. Hey Ben. Hey. 
Aren't many of us left. Yeah. You, me, and Kenny. Clementine. The homeless dude if he sticks around. I don't know. Are you gonna be able to step up? I can do just as much as anyone else. Good. I hope that's true. Carly didn't have to die, you know. She would have killed me instead. Yeah, true. maybe. See you. Yeah. Oh my gosh. The door to the boxcar. Oh wait, let me get in. Okay, I gotta I gotta talk to her. Alright, Clement time. Alright, I gotta help you, Clem. Hey, Clem. Did you talk to him? I did. He had some uh he explained himself and made some good points. Look, we're not gonna let anything bad happen to you. But there are some precautions we have to take. Okay. Yeah, that makes sense. Don't worry, sweetheart. Okay, what should we do? Well, we're gonna figure out a plan for when we get to Savannah. Teach you how to protect yourself and uh, tidy up a little so you can't get grabbed so easily. I like that. Good. Imagine having your whole family die in front of you. That would be the most devastating and traumatizing thing that you could ever experience. Me watching my whole entire family just die in front of me, I possibly could never, never let that happen ever in my life. And I can understand Kenny's pain. I could see why he needs some alone time. But I'm just saying, if he ever needs someone to talk to, or if, we ever need, if he ever needs some help or whatever, I'm there, man. And plus, I really did not want to fight him earlier. I really did not want to do that. But anyways, um... You need to learn to protect yourself. Um, you need to learn to protect yourself. We gotta help her. You need to know how to protect yourself. Like hiding or running away? Got it. I mean, with one of these. First, don't be afraid of it. It's just a thing. Take it. But know where your finger is all the time. And don't put it on the trigger unless you want to hurt somebody. Okay. Okay. Okay, See, come. it's not scary. It's heavy. It is It'll heavy. Get stronger. To aim, you look right down the top through that notch. Line up the sight at the end with your target. Is there anything else I should know? All right, take a deep breath. Aim for the head. When you're ready to shoot, make sure you're not breathing too hard, and then hold your breath right when you pull the trigger. Like when I'm swimming. No, just for a quick second. I found that if I did that, I was a lot more accurate. It's tough, but it'll help. I can do that. Okay. Okay. So it seems like we're helping out Clementine. A Glock is a good gun. It's one of the most common guns. Good. They're really good. Don't lock your elbows. Okay. I don't lock your elbows. First shot. Squeeze the trigger smoothly, and I'll cover your ears. Nice okay. and easy. You got this, Clem. Nice and easy. Ooh. You okay? My hands hurt. I don't like this. Let's stick with it, okay? Do I have to? You're gonna have you're gonna have to use one of these one day, Clem. There you go. Aim. Okay. Aim a little bit to the right. Bit to the right. Bit to the right. A little higher. Maybe just a little bit higher. Okay, a little higher. Ooh, maybe a little too high. Wait. Aim left. Okay. A little bit more to the left. A little to the left. And keep it steady. Steady now. Almost Come on. Got it. Ah! Hold on. Hold on. We're trying to th this is our first time, okay? I'm trying to I'm trying to help her out. So let's aim. Let's aim okay, we're gonna aim right, but we're gonna keep it steady this time. Or no, actually, we're gonna keep it steady. Steady now. Keep it steady. Almost got it. Now aim lower. Aim lower. There you go. Good job. Excellent. Good job. Good job, Clem. Good job. All right. Let's set up another one. Y'all like this. We're teaching Clem how to survive. Okay, okay, okay. All right. So aim to, I would say aim to the left. A little bit more to the left. All right, now keep it steady. Close. Now keep it steady. Oh, okay, you gotta aim a little low. 
So wait, aim to the left. Okay. Aim a little bit more to the left. Aim to the left, and then aim lower. A little bit lower. Oh, okay. So you gotta go to the right. So go to the right. Aim more to the right. Okay, go to the right and keep it steady. Steady now. Almost got it. Hey! Good job! Yo, W. Clem, she's getting the hang of this. I'm liking this. I'm sure we both know this is a good kid and parent bonding time in Texas. Definitely, man. I'm loving this. Hey! Let's go! Good job. She's doing it. I was holding my breath, and the gun didn't shake so much. See, you did good. They're not walkers, though. No, far from it. But you know how these things work now. We'll graduate you to walkers one day. Okay, I feel good. Not so scary, huh? Nuh-uh. I'm liking this. Good job, Clem. Seeing this is making me want to shoot some bottles. For real, though, bro. I don't kind of. I could want to shoot some bottles. I want to do that. All right, yo. It's twelve nineteen in the morning. So this is gonna be a very late stream. Oh, it's a bottle of whiskey. I could take this. I'll take some of that. Oh, it's, it's Phil. Oh, it's a fit the whiskey. Okay. Got a backpack. There's some scissors in Chuck's bag. Oh, scissors! Um, we need to uh, give her a little bit of a haircut so it doesn't make it easier for walkers to get her. They look clean enough. Alright, they're clean. Show scissors. Alright, Clem. Hey, you just gotta, we gotta fashion you up a little hi. bit. So you're probably not gonna like this. Oh, no. What happened? Oh, it's nothing, nothing crazy. We have to talk about your hair. It's not safe. That's not nice. No, no. What? That's not what I Are mean. Are you saying it smells? No, 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 Clem. Because it does. Kinda. Do you remember when Andy St. John grabbed it and I got mad? Yeah. Well, that could happen again. And if it's a walker, well, we need to trim it. Just a trim, right? Just a trim. I need to cut it short enough so that it can't get grabbed. <sighs> okay. Okay, let's go. And if we do this now? I guess not. Don't no, mow. No. It's a good thing. It's a good thing, Clem. Just we're trying to we're just trying to help you get better. Do you know how to do this? How hard can it be? How hard can it be? I'm going to look like a boy. Shush now. Come on, Clem. I got this. So you did kill someone before. Yeah. I'm glad you finally told me. Me too. You've killed lots of things now. It doesn't even matter. Exactly, it doesn't matter. See, she's starting to she's starting to get used to this now. It's different. No, it's different. But you do it now to protect yourself. And to protect me. That is I true. Was sent to jail. Did people ever go to jail when they shouldn't? All the time. All the time. Okay. I think I'm about done. I can probably tie these pieces back with something. Here. I have some hair thingies. You do? Uh, yeah. Lily gave them to me for sleeping. Okay. There. All set. Okay, chat. Come Does on, Clown. No. no! You look cute. And a lot harder to grab. She actually doesn't look bad. Chat, what do you think I chat? How do you, how do you think I did? That's not bad. I like that. It's not bad. Clementine Clementine's hair is a lot safer now. That's good. We taught her how to survive and we made her a lot more harder to grab. So that's good. It's really good. Um, let's talk with her more. I'm sorry about your hair. I think it looks cute though. Mom isn't going to like it. Um, I'm gonna look around for a few things. What could we do? What do you think about Chuck? What do you think about Chuck? I don't know. Me neither. He might be an okay guy though. You think? We'll keep an open mind about him. He's probably had it pretty rough. True. I need to look around for a few things that'll make sure we're prepared when we get to Savannah. That would be good. I hope it's safe there. God, me too. I hope, man. Who knows, man? Looks cute and can't be grabbed. 
I like that. Um, so what else we got? I have a bottle of whiskey, which I mean I don't drink, so I'm not gonna do much with it. Um, I don't know what else to do. Oh wait, oh hold on, you open the door. Got a bottle of whiskey. Maybe I can give this a chuck. I think. Actually, I think I can do that. I'm gonna, I'm gonna give this a chuck. All right, we're just we're gonna leave Kenny alone for now. What is this? He's not, I'm not going to touch the console. It's going to mess up everything. All right. Let's talk to him. All right, Chuck. Well, the girl can shoot. It doesn't have to be pretty. Probably will be before too long. All right. See, look at that. I can give him a bottle of whiskey. I found this if you want it. Damn. Didn't realize I had it left. Thank you. <laughs> want a nip? I don't... I don't know. I don't really drink. Nah, I don't drink. It's probably gonna mess up. Uh, no, nah, I'm fine. Yeah, it's probably gonna mess up my. Uh, yeah, it's whiskey, so it's gonna mess up my vision or something. It's gonna make me go drunk or something, and I can't do that in a zombie apocalypse here. Anybody in there want to share a drink? You let them know. Will do. All right, for sure. You get that hair sorted. Yeah, I don't think she cares for it. She will. Okay. Hey. Yo. That's it. Oh, that's it. All right. So we got mostly everything out of the way. Um. See, I don't know. It's like I want to touch. Lucky enough to get it working once. Oh, I was gonna say if I were to touch it, something were to happen. Can I? Can I get the map though? Mind if I look in there for a second? I really wish he'd just leave me alone. Okay. Yeah. Never mind, Kenny. Yeah, Kenny does not want to be. He is not having it. He does not want to be bothered right now at the moment. All right. All right. There's not much I can find though. Oh, oh, it's a blood stain. I hope we're not on this train much longer. Yeah, me neither. It's nothing else. Chuck's camp. He's lived here a while. He has. All right, let's have to climb more. My hands hurt and my ears have noise in them, like. Oh, like ears are ringing. Get used to it. Yeah, ears ring. What a crappy day. The crappiest. If yeah. Three months ago, I'd known what you'd be seeing. I don't know if I would have taken you with me. I probably would have run out of food. You damn near starved with me. I'm glad I came with you. Is Ben doing all right? Um, we're gonna talk to Ben afterwards. We're gonna talk to him. I'll be right back. Okay. Oh man. Yeah, this is by far the most crappiest day I could ever experience. We've already Ken lost his family. We lost Carly due to some something extremely petty. And I'm actually glad I'm actually glad we did what we did to Lily because we did not want to lose anybody else if her ego got hurt again. Hey Ben. Hey. See ya. Oh. Yeah. Okay, Ben seems to be doing okay. So yeah, not much is happening right now at the moment. Only we could, if only we could communicate with Ken, though. Because I, I know he's not doing fine, but just come on, man, please. Hey. Yeah. Uh, Chuck wanted to know if you wanted, if you needed a drink. Chuck wanted to know if you needed a drink. He's got some. Yeah. yeah. Oh. That'd help. Oh, I had to move. I had to get him out of the way. Okay, now I can get it. Nice. All right, I got a map. All right. Thanks. No problem, Kenny. Yeah, I didn't know. I, I didn't know I had to get him out of the way. Okay. All right. Hold on. I think I could show this map to Clem. Maybe she knows where she's going. Wait, what? Uh -huh. I was the one giving the bandits supplies. What? What? It was you, Ben? Ben! It's all my fault. Ben. Why? Jesus, Ben. I know. They said they had my friend. That he was with just, them. Just stop. Fuck. Can we even trust you? Yes. Why'd you have to go and tell me that? I just... No. Just don't tell anybody. You can't take any of it back, so don't. Okay. 
Ben, come on, man. Please. Are you serious? Ah! Ben, don't. Oh, snap. Wait, hold on. Map. Ben really messed up. Hey, Clint. Hi. I want to talk about Savannah. Me too. And what we're going to do when we get there. We don't know what to expect. The city could be bad or totally under control. The thing is, you and I, we're a team, you know? And a team needs a plan. Aside from everyone else, when this train stops, you and I should know exactly what we're doing. A plan. I like it. <laughs> Good. We need to help find a boat. It's our best bet at safety. Okay, but we'll be in Savannah, and my parents were in Savannah. I know. Look. No, I don't care about safety. I care about finding them. Oh, jeez. Okay, we'll look for them, but then the boat. Okay, we'll look for them. Really? Yes, of course. I'm sorry. Let's look at the map. If we can figure out where they were, we can start there. Okay, let's. Looks like we'll come right through town if there's nothing on the tracks to hold us up. We're gonna wanna look for a boat here, I imagine. And from there, we've got all the Savannah to the southwest of us. Now we've got a good chunk of Savannah here. What do you think? They always stay in the same place when they go there. It's, uh, hmm. Hey, don't worry, we'll figure it out. Have you ever been there? Once. Well, think about it. There are a lot of hotels on here, but read this map and maybe it'll jog your memory. They've got really tasty desserts. It's called the, um, um, something Mar. Is this it? The Marsh House? Yes, that's it! So we'll head there. Yes! You think we have a good plan? I think it's very good. Can I tell my parents? You know. About what? Come on. I don't I think she's talking about nah I don't know. That's not a good idea. You can't tell me what to do. Clementine. I don't want to talk about it anymore. Alright. How do you feel? Good. Better. I'm glad we have a plan. And you're a good little chef. Thanks. I guess we should see how far. Oh shit! Hold on, everybody! What? Oh! Ah! Jeez, dude. That's screech. Um, Ben, yeah, that is true, though. I mean, Ben did make a mistake, and he is still a kid. He's still learning. I understand. He's probably like 18 years old. He's, he's probably my age. So, it's cool, but still. Oh my god, what happened here? Fuck, 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 fuck! Dang! Maybe we could walk? That's no. fucking stupid, Ben. Let's I'm not just walk. Saying. Hmm, I don't know. I ain't got much experience with y'all's fortitude, but we could probably deal with that. We got a goddamn train. That thing's not full of milk, Charles. That's gas or diesel. Something that's gonna explode. You gotta get a hold of yourself. This a crew here. Kenny? This ain't shit. This. Yo! Guys! You screaming like that and you're gonna get oh! your ass chewed off. Are you guys gonna be trouble? Because we could have just kept walking. Oh, it's new people. Um. No, oh, we're, we're friendly. friendly! Put your hand down, kid. That's what everybody says. We know. Let's give these guys a break. We'll see. You guys got a problem with your train? Yeah, you're standing right in front of it. Dude, it's a wreck. It's not so bad from up here. Send your buddy up to have a look. Anything goes sideways up there. We won't let them escape. Okay. He's just old enough to be able to mess up all the, mess up big time. Yeah, that is true. I mean, like, cause usually when you're at like when you're like 18, or even if in your if even if you're in your 20s, you make a lot of mistakes. Which you know a lot of people still consider 20 year olds and 18 year olds as kids still, cause we still make a lot of mistakes. So I can understand as to why. And plus, you know, he's just, he panics a lot, so definitely for sure. If I come up there, you better not be murderers or thieves. I guess you'll have to find out. See, when you say that, that worries me. I'm kind of scared to even trust Google these guys. guys. Is what we need. They're what you think we need. We're doing fine. 
for now. What about when... Stop it. Hey, dude. I'm Omid. Lee. Omid. Krista. What's the deal with the train? Krista. We're driving it. Oh, man. Okay. Um... We're not in the mood for new people. Hey, I'm not gonna bullshit you. Our group is a little fucked right now. We had a bite victim, then his mom took her life, and before that, just... It's okay. Oh, shit! God damn, you guys have a kid! What are you doing up here? Do you know how long it's been since I've seen a kid? Shit! What's your name? Clementine. Oh, so he gets to swear. Oh, this is great! See? Things are looking up. You're not her dad. He down there? It's that obvious? To me. And no, he's not down there. Huh. What's your story? I came across Clementine alone. First day all of this happened. We've been together ever since. And everybody down there, they're cool? Uh... We just met Chuck, but he seems like an alright guy. You always have to worry about new people. I used to love meeting new people. That must have been a long time ago. Yeah. We're sorry for anything that's happened to you guys. That train is awesome, though. That tank is your real problem. We'll help you with it, but if we see anything we don't like, we're moving on down the road. Alone. We'd appreciate the help. You can't just blast through it, I guess? If you could get it down, the rest would probably be pretty easy. We'll start there. We'll come down and settle in and see if we can help. How exactly are we going to move this out of the way? That's what I want to know. Like, look at this. So we got a hitch here. There's no way I'm pulling anything apart down there. Yeah, because if that thing falls, it's going to bust and explode. So we got a generator here. It's empty. Oh, uh, what's this? An FRS truck? What's in here? Oh, it's just stop signs and cones. Uh, such a truck. What's it? Oh, what That's is about that? the only useful thing in here. Was that tape? Oh, I think that was tape. Empty. That's what I figured. Okay, so... How exactly are we going to be able to find, like, um... I don't know, like, uh... Well, like, what exactly can we even do with the, the tape? I mean, he said that was the only useful thing, but what can we even do with this? I don't even know what to do with that. Alright, except to Krista. Am I going to have to tell your people the plan, or what? Oh, you want me to tell them the plan? Okay. Guys, this is Omid and Krista. Not big on welcomes? Like I said, it's been a bit of a day. We just wanted to say hi and say your train is pretty cool. But we are not looking for charity. We could help you guys, though. These two are joining us. We'll see about that. Gotta be careful about newcomers, I say. I don't know what it is. I could tell you two are good people. You want to start in on that tanker? I'll get to know the girl for a minute, if you don't mind. And why don't I show you how this thing works? In case something happens. Really, Ken? It's probably for the best. Someone might want to have a look inside of that station back there, too. Sounds great. Let's do this thing. Okay. Alright, so, I'm st I really am trying to figure out how the heck we can get this out of the way. So, I think I gotta... Oh, okay, I can't talk to Chuck, so... It's time to figure out how we're gonna get this giant tank out of the way. What the heck? Ben, what's he doing up there? Got a clear view up there? Yeah, we're good for a ways. Okay. Thank God. We need someone, anyone, to come along and, and exterminate them or something. All right. Let me see them. Get used to them. I don't think they're going anywhere anytime soon. Well, their numbers keep going up. And ours... I'm telling you, Lee. If they ever get a hold of me, and I know I'm not getting out of it, that's it, man. I'm just gonna punch my own ticket. Punch your own ticket? Punch your own ticket. Yeah. Take myself out. Come on, Ben. Don't be don't. dramatic. Yeah, Ben, don't, don't do that. And don't let them get a hold of you. Yeah, don't let them. Yeah, you have to, tr you have to let them not do that. So anyways, we need to figure out how to get this out of the way. And just how exactly are we... Okay, so we can't go over there. Alright, that's good, that's good. 
All right. Um, got Chuck over here. So what can I do? Like, can I use this? What can I use this for? Use a tanker? This would create one hell of a fireball if we tried to blast through. Yeah. Um, got that. I don't know what that is. All right, let's go. Oh, here they are. All right, Krista. Oh, you come interrogating time. this woman for us. Yep. She set off any alarm bells? Not yet. She's very thorough. <laughs> That's what I like to hear. Got a cutter or something in the train? Um, I don't know. We have, we'll have to see. But we're just trying to figure this out right now. How we're gonna move this out of the way? But we're safer now. Okay. Learning the ropes. Learning the ropes can't be too hard, right? There are a lot of levers I can't wait to use. I said if something were to happen to me, maybe we can drive in shifts. We'll see. Okay. How have you two made it this far? You seem dangerously normal. Krista doesn't let us join groups, and I'm a fucking scrapper. I got the feeling she <sighs> takes care of you. Please. I've saved her ass hundreds, tens, sometimes. <laughs> yeah, Krista definitely takes care of them. Uh, how long since you've been home? How long since you've been home? Like six months. We were on the road for a while, and then, you know. That's rough. Her cat is going to be pissed. Talk to you later. <laughs> cat people. All right, Kenny. Teaching them anything? Trying to. Okay. Um. So it doesn't seem like we have any cutters or anything on here. So how exactly are we going to move this out of the way? All right, I like these new people. So yeah, Omin and Krista, I can definitely tell these two are good people. 100%. percent i am talk to Krista. Hey there. That's a pretty useful radio for her to be holding on to, no? It's busted, but it means something to her. Oh, I understand. Uh, careful, she's a crack shot now. Um, where are you from? Where are you from? San Francisco. Jeez, a long way from home. I blame the one in there. He wanted the great American road trip. Well, he got a little more than he bargained for, huh? Who the hell is into Civil War history anyway, other than old white guys? Dang. <laughs> He's really a teacher. He's into that stuff. Careful. She's a crack shot now. You got this girl shooting guns? Look, I don't need a lecture. You weren't getting one. It's good. She should be able to take care of herself. What were you two arguing about when I was coming up the ladder? Nothing. If you're gonna be around for a while, be good to know what baggage you got. And maybe we won't be around for a while. Mmm. Krista don't appear. Don't, Krista don't appreciate you prying into our business. Yeah, I probably shouldn't have said that. Not sure how we'll get Not that sure tank down. Sure, how we'll get that tank down. Maybe ask me. He likes to break things. Ah. Question is though, he's not gonna get us all killed though, is he? Cause I don't want him to accidentally make this thing explode. This is gonna be one hell of a fireball if it blows up. I'm a cat person, I can confirm my cat is always pissed. I mean, I'm not a cat person, I just think cats are funny. Talk to you later. Oh, well, it's not much. So, how exactly can we get this down? Maybe there's something out there we gotta go for. Okay. Something up here? Mmm. It's nothing much up here. No, I can't use that hitch. All I have is tape. Look. All, okay, all I have is a wrench and some tape. That's all I got. But what exactly can I do with this stuff? Um, they're funny when, <laughs> um, for no reason, despite doing everything, for, despite doing everything for them. That is true, though. That's true. Um, I'm trying to figure this out, though. So I can't use. There's this no dish. way I'm pulling anything apart down there. All right, what else can we do here? Got Ben over there. Okay. Honestly, like, if we can't go anywhere, like, if we can't, um, did you talk to the guy? Yeah, I, I tried, but, um, 
What's it called? It wouldn't let me. He, would, he didn't even say anything. And plus, I talked to him already. Yeah, we already talked to Omid. Alright, maybe let me let me try again. Maybe he has has something useful to tell me. Talk to you later. Nope, he doesn't. Teaching him anything? I'm trying to. Yeah, I already spoke to these two. So, anyways, we need to figure this out. Maybe look around the area for something that can be used to cut. Like what though? Like got like bolt cutters or something? Okay, we can't talk to Chuck. Um, uh, what can I use? Okay, I can't I can't go up here. So Is there anything we can use? All this power and we're still stuck. <sighs> Alright, where exactly is it at, bro? Like I feel there I know there's something we could look for. Um, oh! It's a train station! What? Um, I could walk there. Yeah, maybe there's something in the train station. Can I follow you over there? You don't like the new girl? I do, but it's like we're a team, like you said. Yeah, all right. Come on. Clementine and I are checking out this train station, all right? Hustle over if you hear anything. Okay, that's nice. All right, what do we got over here? Probably gonna find, like, what, like, bolt cutters or something? Survivors inside. What? What is this place? I don't know what that means. Um, well, it's a train station, first of all. Wait, what is this? It's just a uh, buckets of paint. Paint cans. P paint cans. Um, something here. There's got to be something. And it's and on top, yeah, like you see that it says survivors inside. Like, look at that, dude. Tell me that does. Tell me that does not look weird. Survivors inside. Somebody must have been pretty desperate. Ah. Oh, they put that up there so just in case, like, they come across a helicopter. Okay. I see what they did there. Okay. So what we got here? Look at the sign. Anything? Wait, where's Clementine at? Oh, there she is. I was gonna say, you don't split. wait for me before trying to open doors. Sorry. Uh, luckily, it's locked. We'll get better at working together. Yeah, like I said, stay close to me now. You want to wander off? Maybe you can find an entrance on the side. Um, sh can I shove? No, no, no. I can't shove it. It's a, uh, it's boarded up. I can't use it. What's it? Well, a forklift? Does this work? Doesn't look like that thing's worked in years. Mm, no, it doesn't work. I uh, can't go that way. I have a wrench. Like, can I try to pry the door open with that or something? No, I mean, all I can do is shove it. <clears throat> Won't burn. Okay, I need to find... Alright, there's a sign over there, but what else? Okay, we're not going back. There has to be something in this place. It's like a common time. We'll have to find a way in. Okay, so... Oh! It's a window! The window's open up there. Maybe I could look in? Yeah, yeah. Let's give it a try. Why don't I put you on my shoulders and you can peek into that window up there? Sounds good. Nice. Let's go, Clem. <sighs> okay, I can see in. What do I do now? Um, getting this door open is going to be tough. Um, well, what do you see? What do you see? Lots of crates and stuff. Maybe we can find the key or figure out a way to knock this door down. Kenny'd probably have me pick the lock. Which actually might work now that we have the time. I think I opened it. Oh! I think so. Did you just, you just open the door like that? Bro, Clem. this is what I'm saying. Clem, you smart little gal. Wow. Okay, nice. You can't see in there. All right, let me open the door. Let's go. Be careful. I'm supposed to tell you that. <laughs> Yo, Clem's getting brave over here. That's what I'm saying, man. Clem, she is really involving. Do you hear that? Sounds like somebody's typing. God damn, it's dark in here. Uh -huh. Maybe I can hold the door open? I don't like that. I'll prop it open with something. Yeah, yeah, yeah let's prop it open. My wrench? I, I can prop it open with the wrench. Yep, got my wrench. Uh, Here we go, prop it. Yeah, let's just leave it open just in case. Okay. So what we got up in here? It's 
a whole bunch of junk. There's got to be some tools or something in here we could find. Locked up good. Okay, we can't get in there. Uh, what? Look, there's got to be something. Oh, it's a gap. There's some space up there, but not much. We're lucky I'm so little. Yeah, we are. There goes Clem. Clem's back at it again. Oh my gosh. Let's go, Clem. You okay going over the top of this fence? Yeah, definitely. <laughs> Let's go, Clem. You got this. Go on and grab the keys, Clem. Good job. Come on, scoot. Wait, what? What do you see? Behind you. What? Walker. Uh oh. Oh snap. Oh, it's two. Oh. Oh snap. Um, my wrench. Wait. Uh, get, get the wrench. Get the wrench. Get the wrench. Get it. Pick it up. Pick it up. Pick it up. Pick it up. All right. Pick it up. And uh, that's one. Attack it. Attack it. Attack it. Come on, Lee. Clee, you know. I say, Clee. Lee, you know better than this, man. Come on, bro. There we go. Whoo! Good job. Wait. Oh, she shot it. I thought I killed it. I didn't even notice that. Hey, it's okay. Everything's fine. Whoo! Good job, Clem. Let's go. Oh, it's another one. Uh oh, Clem. Clem. Jeez, now. Hurry. Let's get it. Get it. Get it. Get it. Give, give me the keys. Oh, 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 open up. Still locked. Wait, open it. Open it, open it, open it. Open it. Come on, go, 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 go. And bop. There we go. Oh, man. God damn. That didn't go so good. No, it did not go so good. But we're okay. Everything's okay. Yo, W Clam, though. What's going though. on? I thought I heard a gunshot. We're fine. We're fine. We're good. We found some walkers. You and an eight-year-old versus three of them, huh? Mm-hmm. It's what we do. <laughs> we handled it. Yeah, it looks like. What if you hadn't? We got this, Krista. We're gonna go make sure the noise didn't cause us any problems. That's a good idea. Not exactly fair for the walkers. <laughs> I hope you know what you're doing with her. I do. We're still alive, aren't we? We're still alive, aren't we? Yeah, you are. Yeah, why is Krista so sus? Like, so suspect about it. Alright, anyways, now that we're inside, let's see what we got. Um, let me talk to Clement Time real fast. You sure you're okay? Yeah. I'm a little shaky. It'll pass. Let's go. Okay, let's see what we got up in here. So we got a blowtorch. We got it. Let's go outside now. What okay. We learn? I'm not ready for a gun. They'll learn to pull the trigger. Oh, well, we learn not to be afraid, actually. We learn not to be afraid. They should have got us. But we got them. Yeah, you're right. Exactly. Fear is the thing that will kill us. You understand? She might be suspicious of you. The guy did mention she didn't like she didn't let them join groups. But that's really good to know though. Alright, uh anything they didn't over have there? much business back then. Alright, we got it. We got a blowtorch. Wonder what we could do with this. Alright, Clem, time to go back. Um, can I open the door? Alright. Yo, Clem is really evolving. She's becoming more of a badass now. I found a blowtorch in the station. Should make quick work of the coupling up there. Excellent. I'll come up there with you to have a look. Alright, Omid. Alright, let's go. Clem is carrying the group at this point. For real though, for an eight-year-old? Yo, she's really doing some work. Like, she's really telling me to be careful. That's my job. But, yo, props to her. All right, let's do it. All right, we got a blowtorch. All right, what do we do now? All right, 
Gas is going through. Shit. What's what? The hose has a leak in it. Turn it off, dude. I, I don't want my eyebrows burned off. Yeah, yeah, turn it off, turn it off, turn it off. Better plug that leak with something. What have I got? Oh, the tape! Yeah, there we go. Progress. Nice. All right, now let's try it. There we go. All right. That's crazy. Look at it go. Just about got it. Oh, it's, gonna, oh, it's about to fall. It's about to fall. Woo! Oh, thanks. No sweat, man. That was this close. Thing is hanging by a thread. The smallest cut, and it'll go. All right, one more time. I can't reach it now. Oh, I can't reach it. Damn it! It was just about done too. Okay. Crap. Uh, what do I do now? Um. Oh, give it to him. Here. The weak portion of the coupling's out of my reach. You think it'll be within mine? <laughs> no. But I'm gonna dangle you over that ledge. <laughs> the hell you are. I have to. It's the smallest cut. God, you're a real son of a bitch, aren't you? Shut up and start cutting. I got you. Oh, walkers. Oh my god. Um, we got an army of walkers. All right, gang, we need to hurry. There's something coming. What the what? There must be thousands. Yeah, there's we thousands of those go. things. Fuck. Oh me. Cut, cut. Cut it, cut it, cut it, cut it. Cut it. Cut it! Pull me up. Okay. Woo! Oh! Kenny, go! Go, Kenny! Bro! Look how many it is! It's leaking! What the hell do we do? We gotta jump over. We gotta go. We gotta go. We gotta jump. We gotta jump. What? No way! We have to! Come on, man. Alright, we gotta land on the train. Alright. Have it your way. Jump! No! We have to Jump, go! Damn it. Still no! Fine! Alright! You really wanna do this, Omid? Uh. Oh! Come on! There you go! Ah. No! Shit! Omid! Help him up, help him up, help him up, help him up! Come on! Get up! Ah, oh, his leg! Come on! Alright, he injured his leg. He should be fine. Come on, go, 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 go! Come on, get up. Uh, All right, come Omid. on, Omid. Omid. Son of a bitch, save him. Wait, what? Omid. No! I didn't know. I didn't know we had an option there. Omid. Oh. Okay. Oh, I thought he was dead. Oh my gosh. Clem is the kid we wish we all have for real. Facts. Yo, I thought Omid was dead there. That was a lot of them. Are you hurt? No. We're okay. Speak for yourself. My leg is fucked. We're fine, Clementine. We're fine. We're good. We good. Oh, man. I thought Omi was dead for a second. All right, we're making our way downtown to Savannah now. Making my way downtown. Walking fast. Faces past and I'm homebound. <laughs> But on a serious note though, we finally made it to Savannah. We finally made it. After our long road ahead, we finally did it. Train going fast. <laughs> this is our hometown. Next stop, the Atlantic. The Atlantic. Yo, it's twelve fifty-seven a.m., bro. We just have to. We will. Um. You'll be all right. I'll be alive, I guess. Blood in my heart. Blood in my brain, at least. At least. I'll leave you to your thoughts. She's out cold like I've never seen. Oh! 
Her walkie talkie! It works! What the? Hmm? Wait for you to get to Savannah, Clementine. I got your parents right here. And you be sure to find me whether Lee wants you to or not. Now, what I need. Holy shit. I thought that fucking thing was broken. I thought it was broken too. So did I. Well, it sounds like somebody knows where we're headed. Who the fuck? Who could it be? I don't know. But I doubt we're gonna be happy when we find out. Yo, now I'm nervous. Oh no. Now I'm nervous now. Who's gonna show up? I feel like we're being targeted right now. We did it! That's it. Next time on The Walking Dead. We're almost at the river. You want to get on a boat? You want to wait around till the walkers figure out we're here? We need to focus on finding a boat right now, Clem. Like we talked about on the train. I don't know how much longer he can keep on like this. If his leg gets any worse, we're going to have to carry him. Or leave him. If I were you, I'd get out of the street now. Who the hell is this? Answer me, damn it! So when were you gonna tell us about the radio? Who have you been talking to? You come back here, I'll kill you! You understand? I will kill you! Yo... Around every corner, who is... Th Yo, who was Clem... Who has Clem been talking to this whole time? What? Okay. Uh, Sweet Merciful Depp, did you shoot the girl in the street? 59% of players um, did not shot her. I didn't even shoot her. Because that would, that would make too much noise. Did you leave? Did you abandon Lily? 42%? That should at least be like 80%. I'm just letting you know right now. I'm keeping it real. Did you fight Kenny? Uh, you and 44% of players talked talk them down. That should be way more than that. Um, happy birthday. Did you shoot Duck? 20% did not shoot him. You know, what is wrong with people, man? Cause that's just too that's too cruel. A helping hand. Did you help Omid? Um, did not help Omid. I I didn't know. I genuinely did not know we had an option there. I it all happened so fast. I didn't know we had an option. Dang, bro. And I will say though, this episode alone was by far the most saddest and most tragic episode that we've ever experienced so far in this series. And this is. We're halfway done with this season, so I could just imagine um, what season two has in store for us. But yo, it's freaking 1:01 a.m. right now. It's one o'clock in the morning, so it explains why not. It explains why not a lot of people showed up to the stream because either everyone's sleep, either somebody's sleeping. Well, pretty much everybody is sleeping because like, what else is everybody else doing at one o'clock? Either somebody could be staying up or I don't know, pulling a nine or doing anything else. But that's on them. If if I mean, if you don't want to join the stream, that's completely fine. But for those who miss out on the stream, like I said, these will be going up on YouTube very, very soon. And right now, the first episode um, should be up right now at the moment. So I will always be in the streams, hopefully. And this was probably the most tra This was by far the most tragic and devastating episode. Well, for Kenny, at least, because that was just traumatizing. He lost his family. Um, we lost Carly. Thanks to Lily being so like she got so offended her ego was hurt so bad she really just had to pull out the nine and just bopped her right in the head just like that that just really comes to show how pathetic she really was and i'm actually glad that she's not with us anymore because even if we like i could just imagine if we had her a lot more longer we either would have lost um ben kenny like we pretty much would have lost nearly the whole entire group of she's if we still had her with us so I'm actually glad that we don't have her with we don't have her anymore. And God knows what happens to her, but whatever happens to her, that's on her own. That's a massive that is a massive you problem for her. So womp womp to her. So anyways, that was the third episode. That by far had to be the most tragic episode of the whole entire series. And I don't even know what to think anymore because like I wanted to cry so bad, but like I'm not that like because you, you guys gotta understand, I'm not that much of a sentimental person, so video games and stuff like this don't really make me cry. But it's like, I want to let out my emotions so bad, it just doesn't happen. It's like, I know what I want my emotions to do, but it just doesn't work like that for me specifically. 
Um, she would have killed Ben next. Yeah, she definitely would have killed Ben. Then probably would have tried to kill Kenny. No, she definitely would have um, tried to kill Kenny because them two have not been getting along recently. But, yeah, anyways, this was the third episode. We have up next the fourth episode. And then after that, we have two more episodes. This episode, I am not really feeling too happy about. From the looks of it, Clementine is all alone. And I don't know what's going to happen. And, of course, we have the special episode, which is 400 days. So, anyways, you guys, be sure to stay tuned for episode four and the next stream. This whole series is going by so fast. It's already been three days, well, four days into this series, and we're already halfway done. And I hope you guys are just as excited for the ending as much as I am. So, anyway, guys, I hope you guys, so thank you guys so much for tuning into the stream. And for my YouTube viewers, thank you guys so much for watching this video. And if you did, then please be sure to smash that like button. Subscribe today to see more on my channel. And I'll see you guys in the next video. And... I'll see you guys in the next stream. Bye, guys.